Uh, I'm on episode four of Life is Strange 2. I hope you all enjoy the ride. I'm pretty sure we're in jail right now. So that's where we left off. Uh, we blew up a pot farm, and now I'm pretty Once sure we're in jail. In a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home lair with their papa wolf. They lived in peace until hunters took their dad away. And they had to go on the run. That's when the big brother discovered that the little one was not an ordinary wolf, but a super wolf. They discovered a secret hideout where they could train day and night. They were happy. But the little wolf got very sick, and they had to move on. The brothers made it to the home of their ancestors, and the old wolves took care of them. Unfortunately, the hunters were hot on their trail and found them. The brothers had nowhere to stay again, so they decided to keep going south. They soon entered the old forest of the giants, where they met a pack of stray dogs who worked in a secret farm. Pot farm. The brothers joined them and worked hard to stock up on gold for the future. They were happy to find others like them, and everybody loved the little wolf, who was growing up fast. His power was growing, too. The little wolf was more and more confident and independent. The big brother hooked up with a cool she-dog. <sighs> they had their own adventures. Suddenly, the mean farmers who owned the land tried to hurt the brothers. The little cub was injured. He transformed into a super wolf. And destroyed everything. The big brother was badly wounded. And worse, he didn't know where the little cub was. I love how they revamp the intro every time that we do this based on everything that's going on. Huh? Where my sub? Did I... Oh, Ali, oh, you lost your sub. Your sub said no. Wait, you had it before. I. I it... Hey, Sean. It was. It's up there. I'm I see sorry. it. I didn't mean to. It was a bad idea. Daniel. No way. It's all good. Wait, is this a flashback? Wish I listened. When you tried to stop me from going with Finn, I was too pissed. It's okay, dude. You're my brother. And that's all that counts. Mel, enjoy your so, lurk. Why don't you come and get me? I'm alone, Sean. I don't know what to do. I'm scared. Don't get so close to that edge. Please, come and get me. Yes, I, I swear. 
Uh, stop! All right, maybe we're not in jail. We're in a hospital. Hospital in Northern California two months after the blast at Merrill's. Fuck. Daniel. I keep having these nightmares since I came out of the coma. I miss Cass so much. Wish I could hold her. Howdy, city boy. Bet you're surprised to hear from me. I found out we were in the same hospital from the police after we were questioned when I checked out a month ago, so I took the chance to write and hope you get this. Wish I could say everything I want, but you know, never know who's reading, right? If anybody else is reading this, fuck you. I truly hope you are okay after what happened. As for me, I don't remember much except the explosion at Merrill's office. Then I woke up in the hospital with blunt trauma, healing, and now what the doctors call blast lung injury, hurting. Just glad that I can still play guitar and sing, not that I feel like it. He learned a shitload about medicine stuck in a hospital bed, as I'm sure you know. My sweet compadre is still working on that Espanol. Missed my lessons and my teacher. You probably know more about what's going on than me, but Hannah, Penny, and I were released without charges. The police were stoked to bust a farm of drug traffickers rather than us gutter punks toiling in the field. We asked about you and Daniel, but got no answers. Surprise. So, with Finn and you gone, our rail family is kind of broken up. Now we're just a lonely trio, train hopping up and down the state, but it feels like we're going in a loop to nowhere. Hannah and Penny aren't the same, and we fight too much. I'm not even sure we'll be together for much longer. Shit changes, right? Maybe I'll have a whole new set of blues songs for the road. I know you're going to trail, trial o soon over the Seattle situation and you will get a justice get the justice and freedom that you deserve you and Daniel are amazing brothers and I hope you find your way home soon I hope we can swim naked again under the a new moonlight it's a big world and maybe we'll meet again someday I'll always be singing your song love and peace Cassidy This must be my punishment. Ugh, I can't even focus on the page. This sucks ass, man. Date, March 26, 2017. Was in a coma for weeks, blind and fucked. Plus, in police custody, going to jail soon. Hospitals freak me out. Hate this. Where's Daniel? I'm scared. March 30th, 2017, tried to draw to kill time. This room is like a cage, but I suck now. No depth perception, no art, no shit. Focusing equals immediate migraine. Going crazy over here, woke up crying. April 3rd, 2017, special secret agent Flores. She's trying to bond with me. Trap me or trust me, so fucked. Cops still can't find Daniel after the explosion, so he's out there alone. April 11th, 2017. Happy birthday, Daniel, wherever you are, Nano. April 15th, 2017. Claire and Steven sent me a nice letter, so I so lonely I read it twice. Weird how I miss them now. So cool to hear from Captain Spirit, too. Glad he's doing fine. My Joey sketch doesn't look bad so glad he's around captain spirit's okay april 20th 2017 wish i could hear cast play again all those songs are gone but not our time together april 25th 2017 i fucked daniel up i let finn become his brother
Yay, Captain Spirit. Yay, Captain Spirit is right. So hard to focus. <clears throat> Gotta practice way more. Not giving up. <sighs> I guess that's an okay start. But I can keep going. I wish I could find a highway to freedom. Can't catch shit. Zero depth perception. Goodbye, sports. Yeah. Thanks for the card, Agent. Can't wait to text you. You stocking up, Ange? <laughs> U.S. Department of Justice, Federal Bureau of Investigation, Maria Elena Flores, Special Agent, Seattle Division. Call anytime, day or night, if you want to talk. S A F. Telephone two zero six five 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 zero one one four. Pat Stevens' leg is better. Must be tough on Claire. Sean, we are grateful to find out that you are safe and awake. Police contacted us when you were found unconscious in Humboldt County. We weren't allowed to visit you in the hospital, but we want you to recover ASAP. The doctors say that you woke up from that coma stronger than before. The most important thing now is to find Daniel. We are hope helping the police any way we can. They really want to find him too, Sean. Hopefully this reflects well during your trial. We know this must be hard for you after everything that you and your brother have been through. We, You're both in our thoughts and prayers every day and night. Remember, you are a family and we love you. We hope to visit you in Jelona Shore as soon as we can. Take care, Steven, uh, Claire and Stephen. P.S. Chris insisted to write a little note. It's attached to this letter. P.P.S. He doesn't know that Daniel's missing. So glad Chris is okay. Captain Spirit! That kid is a real superhero on his own. April, enjoy your lurk. Hi, Sean and Daniel. I hope you're okay. I am fine. I miss both of you a lot. But after my accident, I had to wear a stupid cast forever. I was trapped in my room all winter. It sucks. But summer is here, and I can play again. All the snow is gone. You should come back to see the Beaver Creek without the snow. I will be waiting for you, Chris and Captain Spirit. P.S. We need to save Beaver Creek from swamp bugs. That's adorable. Yay. Stupid reality shows. I'm supposed to call the nurse when I'm done eating. Uh, guess I'm done. This day feels like every other day. Just this must be my punishment. Yo, afternoon checkup. Sure. <laughs> Good day, sunshine. Hey, Joey. Hey, man. 
That looks like it might have been food. Hard to tell. Ha ha. Never heard that before. Oh, somebody is in a bad mood. Sorry, Joey. Not feeling it today. Mm, I don't blame you. But maybe I got something to cheer you up. Pecans and chocolate? Uh-oh. There's that smile. Thanks, Joey. So how you feeling today? Any headaches? Socket pain? No. It's all good. Well, this is your final test before... Mm, you know. Before they... Check you out. Check me out to Juvie. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, let's see. You know the drill. Don't blink and just stare at the light. Yes. Nice retina response. Okay. Now, try to follow the light as well as you can. Good, good. Keep going. Quick response. Nice. Sean, you got this. Remember, to see objects on your left side, you got to turn your head more now. Yes. Looking good, Sean. Now try to align your pen with mine. I'll try. No rush. This is tough. Hey, good job. Okay, let's do it again. Your depth perception will always be affected, so you gotta try harder. Oh, shit. Yeah, I know. It's hard. Oh, come on. Damn, <laughs> you hit a double today. Yeah, that's enough. Too much stress on you and your eye. But remember, your depth perception will always be affected. Hmm. Here, read this. I'm a pirate without a patch. Arr. I'd be more worried if you weren't such a smart ass. Well, I know it sucks for you, but... <sighs> this time we release you. Sorry. Your vision has improved a lot. Now, you don't really have severe side effects anymore. Yeah. That's just great. I do have to tell them the truth. But first, let's clean this dress Hey, up. sure hope you're watching the door like your phone. Oh, come on. We ain't going nowhere. Great. All I do is watch him. Yes, true. Your job. Do you mind if we talk alone? Mind if I finish with my patient? He looks good for now, right? Just come back when I'm finished with him. Sure. I'll swing by later, Sean. Stay cool. So, how are you feeling today, Mr. Diaz? Amazing. Did you find Daniel? I want to go over this again. <sighs> what? I've been telling the same fucking story for three weeks. How much longer? Until it makes sense. Until you get it right. So, silence isn't gonna help you now. Listen close, Sean. Tomorrow you're going to Jolina Shore and you'll be arraigned in court for the murder of a Seattle police officer. You might spend the rest of your life in prison, 
or you can talk to me. I'm innocent until proven guilty, right? And I believe that. That's why I want you to tell me the whole truth. It's just, I can't. Was Daniel involved? Is that why you can't talk? No, no way. And you're absolutely sure your dad didn't go after the officer? Are you shitting me? That officer freaked out and shot him! In front of me and Daniel! Just guilty of being... Who knows? I hear you, but... You sure you didn't get upset and go after the officer? It happens. Jesus, no! Look at me. Okay, let's just jump ahead. Tell me what happened in that farm in Humboldt. The place looks like a tornado wiped it out. I've told you so many times. I have no clue why the place was trashed. I passed out. Plus three seriously wounded, along with you. And a missing child. Nobody's a statement matches with each other. Sean, throw me a bone here. Can't you see I want to help? So you haven't found my brother? We might have some leads. You can help by telling me the truth. <sighs> okay. Fuck. The robbery. Whose idea was it? His or yours? Huh? Finn, it was his idea to rip off Mero. Did he force you to help, or did you go along with it? He lied. I didn't want to help, but he got Daniel involved. I swear. Swear I didn't think anything like this was going to happen. Nobody does, Sean. Until it's too late. Yeah. Now I know. And what about Cassidy? She planned all this with Finn? She was against this stupid plan. She had nothing to do with it. Your friends are learning the hard way. They didn't deserve it. We all make mistakes. Yeah, well, some mistakes are worse than others. By the way, we contacted your grandparents in Beaver Creek. They can visit you after you're transferred. Might be a while, but you do have a support group. We couldn't track down your mother, though. Sorry. Good. What about Daniel? You said you had leads. I said might. Uh, hold on. I gotta take this call. Sorry, Finn. Yes. <sighs> she didn't want Nicole. anything to do with this. Yes, Nicole. Everything okay? Wonder what Meryl told the cops yes. about the robbery. Sorry, Hannah. No, Hannah. <sighs> Hope the cops didn't mess with Penny. Prison would fuck him up. Global fam, what up, nerd? What's happening? I'm good, sir. I'm good. Sorry about that. Okay. So what's going on with Daniel? You really have leads? Yes, we do. That's our job. The Bureau put his profile out over four states. So we are on the case. You lied to me. You have no leads. You have no fucking idea where my brother is. I don't lie, Sean. But you did. And your brother is paying the price. Fuck. 
you. I'm done. Anyway, thanks for talking to me. I'll be back tomorrow to take you to Jolina Shore. Look out. I have to guard the guard now. <laughs> Love it. Sit down so we can get this show going. So, how did your interview with Scully go? You mean interrogation? Who knows? Maybe Detective Flores wants to help. Maybe not. I just can't trust her. After what you and your brother went through, I don't blame you. Aw, oh, this shit is all wrong, man. You've been out of the garden for three weeks now. We talk every day. I can see that you're a good person. But I'm not. I've done too many mistakes. I let everybody down. I lost Daniel. And I'm going to juvie. This is all bullshit. Now let's check this out. The healing is coming along nice. Just gotta keep it clean for the next week or so. Simple. That's great. Seen the shrink this morning? What did she say? Nothing I wanna hear. This will take time and rehab, Sean. You have to process first. Ugh. I can tell myself that shit. Clearly, I'm no therapist, but I've nursed patients with your injury. They all turned their anger into energy. You will too. <laughs> Plus, the glass eye tech is pretty cool now. <laughs> Things change, huh? Oh, we got a glass eye? I hear you. I'm trying to be positive. But it's so hard. I know. I do, but I promise there's a treat coming your way. Now, as for your wound, this is the last time you hear this from me. You have to clean it with sterile gauze and saline solution. Coat the area using the swab and cream. Then wrap it up with clean dressing. And you're the shit. Remember, you gotta do this. Four times a day. I won't forget. I'm sorry about everything, Sean. Wish I could have done more. Dude, you saved my ass here. You're the only one I trust. It really helped. Cool. I'm glad when I can make a ch... Oh, shit. Ah, emergency. I'm out. And no smoke break. Let's say our goodbye tomorrow. Oh, Sean, check out that towel. Got your name all over it. Catch you later. Joey, you are her boss. What? Wow. Haven't seen you in a long time. Oh, we got us our journal back. Damn, this guy's cool. Joey's the only one who helped me get through this shit. Can't catch shit. Oh, oh, Zero God. depth perception. Goodbye, sports. Salvation 
lies ahead. I know I fucked Daniel over. Again. And now he's gone. Where would he hide out? A ten-year-old by himself? Out there? He might go back to Seattle. But too far. Nowhere to go. If he tried to hook up with Claire and Steven, they would have definitely told me. Or the cops. Wait, what's that? Super Wolf? Huh? Does that mean? It means that Daniel. Daniel's with Jacob somewhere? He's safe? I could see him again. Huh. 23rd February 2017. Had a few beers. Daniel's asleep. Same night, every night. He wants to train more, but we don't have the time. Plus, we gotta hide. It's not that easy. Sean, I borrowed a blanket and a few other things from your tent. We'll give them back when you come looking for your Super Wolf comic. It's waiting for you, Jake. Twenty third, February, twenty seventeen. Agent four twenty, give me hot dogs. Cassidy the Wild versus Hand of the Wise. Me, two story house shit. A curinal is freaking me out. Oh, that was my drunk uh, sketch last night at the campfire there. I came out fantastic. Depression night. Everyone shared their worst memories. Everyone felt like shit. What a wonderful world. Went to bed early with Daniel. Wish I could have stayed like everyone else. Meh. 24th February 2017. I'm a fucking woo. I'm a swear wolf. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Daniel messed up again. Gotta fix this shit. So fucking tired of running away. All I gotta do is find that page with Jacob's home. Merrill, the owner, big tune to go. Haven Point, Nevada. Met the new workers from Europe. Uh, Anders and Ingrid, or Ingrid, cute couple. Makes me want to travel overseas sometime. I had a long talk with Jacob. He's a, like a little kid. He lived in some religious commune from Haven Point, Nevada. I gotta get to him. I gotta find a way to escape. Tonight. Breaking out of hospital. <sighs> okay. Time to clear off now. This whole hospital is so quiet. So don't make any noise. And find a way to get the hell out of here. Open your backpack and check objectives. Find a way to escape the hospital. Okay, we got some letters. Souvenirs. Over it all. 
guys are right here. Let's run the table. Okay, we just put them into the journal. All right. Joey could probably distract the guard dog. Nada. Yeah. Thanks for the card, Agent. Can't wait to text you. Maybe I could, uh, rig a decoy Sean in the bed. Let's see. I just gotta get past that locked door and an angry guard. I don't even want to bother reading it. This one isn't screwed in. I could pull it off, but it's gonna be loud. <sighs> yeah, that metal bar isn't going anywhere. <sighs> Wish I could just walk out. <sighs> They've been working on these rooms forever. So fucking loud. My backpack has got to be somewhere around here. Sweet dreams, my friend. All right, I can tear that off. I should close these so nobody sees me sleep walking away. Need a superhero to open that shit. Hope my last view of this world isn't this window. One stupid car. And I'm out of here. It's dead tonight. Works for me. I could slip into one of those rooms under construction. That's it. I don't see anything else in here. open that window with my bare hands. Let's do it. <clears throat> hey, what the hell are you doing in there? <sighs> nice job, Sean. <sighs> now the guard is awake and pissed off. Can I have some privacy, please? <sighs> that 
That looks so fake. But it might work for a second. This is Gracie, dude. Oh, we're breaking Don't out of the out. hospital. Just get out. Don't think. Just keep going. Holy shit. Oh. Take a breath, dude. Way too close. Damn, you walk fucking loudly, bro. <sighs> Time to get my shit from the staff room. Sleeping. This is your big chance, dude. Holy fuck, Leia, you got 53k? What if you got 14? That's... That's Finn. No way. What is he doing here? No, oh, we can't wake him up. We just gotta keep going. Daniel's more important than Finn. Pokemon whales? <laughs> That's right, nerd. Hoarding all the monies. Stocked up, but still have 47k. Okay. Okay.
Oh, we stole a car. By the way, hi Alyssa and Leia. I need caffeine. I hope my energy drinks are cold. They're not. We're gonna have a beer instead. That's cold. Sean, no falling asleep while you're driving a car, bro. This isn't how you make a great escape. to get pumped up again if the rice bowl earlier got me. That'll make anyone sleepy. <laughs> Big fuck off bowl of rice. Strange 2, Episode 4, Faith. With sesame seed chicken. Yum. peanut butter sandwich like an hour before stream and it was delicious oh we're a bad kid just sitting on the side of the road in the de middle of the desert smoking a cigarette. This is my room for the night. All right, Fuck. what do we got? My eyes itchy. Yeah, I'm kind of lucky I stole a smoker's car. They stole their cigarettes. Okay. 
Shit. It will never hold until Haven Point. We're gonna need gas. What a mess. Plotus can now add Grand Theft Auto to my file. Yeah. Oh, come on. Did you interview everyone in that hospital? Or what? Okay. Haven Point is straight ahead. Just a few more hours drive. She seems nice. Sorry I stole your car, guys. Rip. Shit. Guess I fucked up her day pretty bad. Must do list. May 8th. Drop off kids. Hospital checkup. Lunch with hubby, Mrs. Scott's x-ray blood test, pick up kids, night shift. Well, at least, I mean, it was at night. Right? Something like that. What do we got in our bag? Alright, we got medical stuff. We gotta clean our eye. I don't even know how long I should keep on using this for. That is a mood, Ange. Yeah, needing food constantly is definitely a mood. Alright. Careful. Man, I should have listened to Joey. This is a mess. I don't even know how long I should keep on using this for. Is that it? Literally nothing else I can interact with here. Cigarettes, fuel, wires, owner stuff. Get some sleep. All right, going to bed. Good night. Seen that got a pee guy in a minute, huh? Such willpower. Yeah, well, we're drinking now, nerd, so there will be peeing. <laughs> Still with me, Sean? <laughs> yeah. Just zoning out. Oh, we're Just dreaming. Just don't do that when you're driving, my son. So, uh, what's the verdict on the new car? I know it's not a new board, but it's got four hot wheels. Thanks for finishing it, Dad. A perfect reward for your excellent report card. <laughs> I'm proud, Sean. You don't even bullshit me when you need cash. Oh, wait, I'm not even really silent. Hey, I'll try to be cool. No dad jokes, huh? I hope you're not too uh, bummed out to go on a big road trip love with you, your Ollie. lovely papito, huh? <laughs> oh, Ollie, you're gonna love the new emote. <sighs> oh, please. You're the coolest dad. How could I be bummed? Excuse me. <laughs> Where's my regular, emotionless son? <laughs> I appreciate it. Think we can hang out for five days without killing each other? Hell yeah. Haven't done that since I was a kid. The slouching sloth? Maybe. So do I. 
Been too long since we went padre y hijo against the road. <laughs> Way too long. Mm. I love road trips. Watching y'all. Good to hear. <laughs> By the way, boy talk. What's going on with that gin, huh? <laughs> you know, going okay, I guess. That was like pulling teeth. Well, I've got a week to find out the truth. I just want to try out new stuff. I mean, figure out what I like, what I want, you know? Yeah, I get it. You're young, you've got time to settle down. A Maybe you will, eventually. <laughs> the pants back, Volby. <laughs> ah, could that be Daniel? Hola, hello. Everything okay, Lila? Oh, Daniel better not be giving you any sass. <laughs> nah. He's an angel. We went to the swing pool, and now we're making popcorn for movie night. Yes! Oh, popcorn so... for movie hey, night? Sean, don't crash the car. He's driving <sighs> real slow and safe. Like a grandma. Thanks for checking in. We'll buzz you when we hit the motel. Lila, you ready? Sounds good. And Sean? Jen told me to say hi. Girl. <laughs> Oh, ho, ho. sounds like someone is still thinking about you. Yeah, I know. Seriously, though, how are you really doing? Hey, Steph. I'm so different now. I don't even recognize myself. Because you've changed. It's like evolution. I know it hurts. <laughs> Big time. Guess I wasn't ready to change. I have total faith in you, Sean. You're a Diaz. You were born to roam and find your way home. God. I love you, Dad. I wish I would have told you more. You didn't have to tell me. You showed me. Oh, by the way. <sighs> hey, wake up. Huh? huh? What? Yeah, what the fuck are you doing on our property? Huh? Oh, man, I crashed hard. Oh, yeah? Come on out, boy. Who the fuck is that? A fucking kid. Get out. I'm Look, leaving. I'm leaving, okay? Uh, no, you ain't. Step out, or I'll call the cops. You don't want that, boy. Okay, okay. I'm coming. Hold on. Good. Now we can see you. So tell us what the fuck you're doing on our land. I drove for so long, I I had to pull over to get some rest, you know? I swear, I had no idea this was your property. There's a fucking sign. Didn't you see it? I was too exhausted. I guess I missed it. He's just a kid, and he's hurt. Look. Yeah? What happened to your eye? Move it. Kayla. <laughs> Hello. Please. I just want to go. Oh, -ho. what's this? Drugs? Yeah, for my eye. Oh, yeah. Did you steal them? Like this car? Listen, it's not what you think. Oh, I think it is. You ain't the first beaner we caught. 
Whoa, buddy. Take his backpack. Dude, come on. Get it. Let's see what he's holding. So? Nothing good. Any money? Fucking toys, man. You still play with toys? Seriously? It belongs to my brother. Leave it alone. Hmm. Fuck this guy. Whoa! You did not. That's it, boy. Get up. Up! Okay, Chad. We fucked with him. Let him go. He's got nothing. Hey. Hold on a sec, Mike. You speak Spanish, Pedro? Huh? What? 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 Hablas Espanol. Chad. So, Professor, how do you say, I'm a dirty thief? Soy un sucio ladrón. Soy un sucio ladrón. Nice. Sounds better when you say it. <laughs> this is fun. Now say, uh, I'm a dirty thief with one eye. <laughs> hmm. All I want to do is learn Espanol. Might be our official language someday, right? See, si, senor? So, one more lesson. How do you say, this is not my country? Fuck off. This is my country. Hoo-hoo-wee! <laughs> Did you hear that? Look, Chad, it's gonna rain. Let's go before we get soaked. No, we took the country back. Hold on. This little thief is fucking with me. You're really pissing me off, you know that? But I'm willing to give you one last chance to make things right. Sing something. What? Just pass the audition and you're free. We'll be very upset if you refuse. Oh, fuck this guy. No. Really? Okay. I warned you, boy. Stop! Stop it, Chad! Uh, what the fuck, man? Uh, 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 <laughs> Holy cow, what are you doing? Listen, you little beaner. Get your shit and go. Now. <laughs> Look, just drive straight and you'll hit the highway. Forget this happened, man, okay? Fuck those guys. Fuck! Fuck! <laughs> oh, and we're out of gas. <laughs> Find their house and burn it? I know, right? Fuck these guys. Fuck these guys so much. So the... The Wolf Brothers were split apart. The oldest wolf was badly hurt. But nothing could stop the wolf from following his brother's tracks.
Ollie, I hope you're okay. That scene is over. I'm sorry if that triggered you. I'm sorry that did trigger you. Yeah, fuck those guys is right. They won't fill you in on uh, what you've missed so far. So, we woke up in a hospital. Um, our eye is fucked up. Um, we found out <laughs> where our brother is, kind of. Well, we have an idea of where he is. So we broke out of the hospital, we stole a car, and now we're coming to get him. And then we had just that encounter. That is the recap. Okay. Still a few hours away from Haven Point. Almost there. Whoa! Ah, oh, shit. Snake! Better stick to the road. I'm looking for stuff. Anything Stop. I can use? Can't run for miles in this heat. Oh. There ain't shit over here. Shit, I need a break. Might be some shade at the next billboard. <sighs> Saw a nature show about desert rattlesnakes. So fuck that way. EJ, how was your day, sir? What's happening? You know what I'm going to ask, EJ. You know what I'm going to ask. Oh, too fucking hot. Yes. Shade. Wife, is there something on Squish's head? I keep thinking I am seeing something. Octopus! Don't worry about your feet. And? Just pace yourself. Angie Octopus! But he's not angry today. He's happy. Happy Octopus! Anyone else drinking? Uh, EJ, I am drinking. I was going to have an energy drink, but they weren't cold yet. So, so I started drinking beer instead. Daniel better be okay. Good call, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Feels like I haven't seen him. Cheers, EJ. Of course I miss everything about him. Even his whining. Yeah. You can't Puppy. wait to get out on your own. Now you are. A skull. It sucks. Daniel might dig this. Opening mine now. Let's go, EJ. Dead animal. Oh, great. No way I'm going to die out here. Shit. This Poor place pony. is freaking me out. Just posted it if you want to see a really good beer. <sighs> so much dust everywhere. What is this really good beer? Let's see. Gotta this. be. Oh, shit, there's a truck coming. Cane Brewing Company, Whoa. head high. Is he honking at me? He's topping. Uh, 
Okay, uh, be cool. Just see what he wants. Are you going to give me a ride, bro? Truckers can't be cops, right? Truck. Hey, need a lift? It's too damn hot to be walking. I don't know what to do here. Mm -hmm. I vote walk. Get in. I don't know. I'm tired. Like, <sighs> we're not supposed to get in the cars with strangers. It's okay, get in. <laughs> get in and steal the truck. Today makes me want to drink, but not gonna. The social stuff gets me today. Trying to keep a little down, reading it. Definitely need a laugh. Till it may or not have something. Have to do something stupid or funny. Oh, that's bound to happen. I'm back. Welcome back, Ollie. Ollie, I'm sorry about that scene. All right, we're gonna we're gonna get in and attempt to steal his truck. Yeah, thanks. Hold up. <laughs> Kayla, I hope you have a better evening hanging out here with us. Will there be more scenes like that? Does anyone know? I'd like a warning for it, please. I haven't played this game before, Ollie. I really don't know. Um, at some point, there is. Do you know when, wife? But it might be next episode, okay. Jeez. What the hell happened to you? I ran into a couple of assholes who beat me up for no reason. Uh, I see. Happens a lot around here. Hey, Anton. You there? Everything all right? Yeah, what's up? GPS tells me you parked in the middle of nowhere. Just wanted to know what happened. I, uh... I had to make a shit stop. Over. <laughs> too much information, but 10-4. <laughs> you mean number two. <laughs> you owe me a beer for that. <laughs> Over and out. All right, I like this guy. This guy's kind of cool. He's covering for Don't us. Don't freak out. I, I wouldn't have picked you up if I cared about that hitchhiking law. Okay. Cool. Ali, thank you for resubbing it. So Tier two for you five hungry months. Or what? You look hungry. Oh, this guy's giving us a sandwich. Uh, sure, let's eat a sandwich. I am. This guy's all right. Thank you. As you heard. Yeah, he got snacks. My name's Anton. It is good, huh? My wife packs the best sandwiches. My wife? <laughs> Messy. Best sandwich ever. Yeah. Seriously. Thanks, sir. Anton. Anton. Right. This guy has a vibe. I know, right? This dude's all right. Good call on getting in the truck. 
What's your destination? Hmm. Haven Point. You've heard of it? Oh, yeah. Straight ahead, about an hour. Where's the pills in that Sandy? <laughs> he is too nice. Sus. Don't jack him for his trucking. No, he's doing all right. Take a nap if you want. You don't have to stay awake to be nice. Hey, don't worry, kid. I'm not a fucking weirdo. Just a boring trucker. Just a boring trucker. Yeah, he's telling us to nap. He fed us a sandwich and now we're napping. All right, this is definitely get, starting to get a little bit sus. Saying that it is not a weirdo. All right, I'm a little sus now. He was he, he had a cool vibe for a minute there. Now he's a little sus. Who's the biggest weirdo? I vote EJ. I agree. I, uh, I agree with that. I don't think there are any more episodes or any more scenes like that in this episode, Ollie. Last stop. Thanks, wife. Even point. Thank you so much. You just be careful out here. These people are kind of weird. Really? Okay. Ten four, good buddy. All right. He wasn't sus. We're good. We made it out. He brought us where we needed to go. And he let us sleep for an hour and fed us. Anton, good guy. Now, now let this be a lesson to all of you. If a trucker stops while you're walking down the road and gives you a sandwich and tells you to take a nap, he's probably a cool guy. I'm just kidding. Don't ever get into a trucker or like a strange person's vehicle. I don't advocate for that. For sure. Life is a gamble. Clearly Bet on the Lord. Wow. He has risen. Happy Easter. Easter. I completely lost track of time. <laughs> April, this is not saying that you can trust truckers. I would not go that far. I can't leave. And we were going to take his truck. Him. I know, right, nerd? We were going to fucking jack that man's truck. Mailbox. Hope those people are caring Christians. Like our grandparents. I'm just gonna run around out front here. Can't leave. Gotta find Daniel. I'm exploring. I gotta have an escape plan. Don't you know how this works? Lessons. Don't get in a truck with stranger. Better steal their truck. That is right, Ollie. Yes. You tell him, Kayla. Don't you start, EJ. You said I lost the game when I've been an angry octopus, so hush and eat a mango. EJ, sit, rat. Kayla just gave you a full-on beatdown. And you had it coming. Hmm. Must be more kids here. Sit, rat. Huh. Have you ever Daniel watched Criminal friends. Minds? I have watched Criminal Minds. I've watched quite a few episodes of Criminal Minds, actually. It's a good show. I can't see anything. Guess it's time to go to church. Don't cry at me. Don't you cry at me, you little bitch. EJ, did you open your beer yet? Are you drinking with me? Are we doing shots too? Do you have whiskey? I'm so glad this guy picked me up. Did you watch the trucker episode? I'm stupid to worry about him. Uh, I don't remember offhand. Weird. Looks like our old training range. Practice zone. I'm drinking boo, no whiskey. God damn it, EJ.
think he was trying to tell me something about this place. I don't want to go in there. What are they doing around here? Except going to church. No whiskey? Rude. I know, right? EJ, I have a bottle of whiskey and moonshine sitting right next to me here. And I'm sad because you don't have anything to drink with me. Uh, other than beer, which is not, not, not going to cut. like a giant slot machine. But this place seems different. Yeah, forgive me while I just explore this entire place before I actually go inside and talk to people. I'm looking for things and stuff. I got booze, but effort. Ooh, what do you got, Ange? You have anything tasty? I have to chill mine for the Feels... next time. Smells like bacon and bread in there. Well. Oh, shit, I'm starving. Don't forget, EJ's got his, uh. His Kingdom Hearts stream tomorrow, so you can place. chill it and have it ready for tomorrow, Ange. Alcohol in Kingdom Hearts, that's a good time. Aggressively hydrate with water. God damn it. Why? Why would you do that to me? I wonder what kind of community this is. Did Jacob really live here all his life? Gin and tonics, a bottle of rose lemonade gin, espresso martini, etc. I'm at week I'm at work all weekend. Okay. Also. Where are you, Daniel? And give me um I guess it's time to go to church. Um, um, um give me uh give me your work's phone number so I can call and uh you, I'm gonna call in sick for you this weekend, wow. and th they'll have to listen to me. So Must be a pretty good church to drive all this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, tomorrow, Dylan. Tonight's shine. We are chilling and enjoying a good story tonight. Yes. Not much different. You than just my got Kingdom Hearts stickers. tomorrow. People tend to showcase what they love. So we're gonna have. Another great story tomorrow, because Kingdom Hearts is amazing. Is there really nothing fucking out here? I literally went around this entire goddamn My building. Eye is itchy again. Shut up about your eye. Shut up about the sun. You okay? Hydrate. Now? What the fuck? Is it gone? Stop I, it. I think. Good. Scoot back inside now. Okay, Dad. Yeah, get me a weekend off, uh, please. Hello there. And I right? will I will call yeah, them up and yeah. take care of that for you. Don't worry. You here for the service? Uh not really. Looking for someone. Don't be shy. Everybody's welcome here. No matter who you are or where you're from. In his eyes, we are all equal. Plus, we have a pretty nice spread after the service. Stay as long as you want. Okay. Um, thanks. <laughs> Don't thank me. I'm just a vessel for our reverend. Thank her. <laughs> Looks like you're here to see our new miracle, right? Uh, what miracle? <laughs> you haven't heard of him? Then I won't spoil it for you. He'll be here any minute now. Just come inside and see for yourself. Here's the plan for Asia shoot tomorrow. We make him eat. Let's make Dylan eat. Dylan eat. Dylan is behaving today. I am that behaving every girl. day. <sighs> yeah. Very humble. That poor little girl. I don't know if I want to go in here yet. I want to go knock on that other bad. door. Her father was nice. <sighs> Maybe people won't judge me here. Wait, there's a group hydrate? Why are you trying to make me drink water? Stop it. Oh, drink up, bitches. We need food order things on the stream, but if it's anything like Ricky's, it doesn't work. Uh, Ange, I actually tried to set that up. 
Um, but I couldn't figure out how to set it up. I, I will have that eventually. Yeah, there, there's, uh, there's a thing. There's a thing for it, EJ. We should, we should set it up together so that people can buy us food. Because we need to eat. I want to go in this Maybe door. Maybe I can ask a bit more about this place. Hello? Is that it? Hello? Hello? Open the fucking door! No, oh, I guess I can't go in there. Alright. Alright, now with the real question is do we go in the front door or do we go in the back door? Because we got a back door. We can go in the back door. Get Dylan Donuts. Uh, we were actually at that grocery store yesterday and they had donuts. Well, they didn't have many because we went pretty late, but they always have donuts. We always like it in the back. Uh, so EJ wants us to go in the back door. Uh, Ange wants us to go in the front door. Alright, back or front? Anyone else? EJ likes entering through the back door, apparently. Let this be known. EJ likes back doors. I need more beer. EJ is getting holy water thrown on him. A rangaroo has been caught by wife and Ange. Let's okay. go, wife. Let's go, Ange. Where are you, Daniel? Nerd's just gonna whistle and ignore that. Nerd, you're an angel. Woo! Ollie, did you hear that? Let's go, Ange and Alyssa. Woo! Nerd, love you. Alright, I guess we're going in the front door because we're not going to be six savages like EJ and enter through the back door. Love you, EJ! Damn, EJ, 7% off from 69. Oh, feel that cold air. Oh, thank God for AC. Why are they talking about my brother like that? Praise be to Daniel, your friends, the Bladies. We saw the miracle child of Jesus today in Rev Frischer Church. Thank you. I wouldn't believe it unless I saw it with my very own eyes. Daniel is an angel sent down onto us. Hallelujah. Shaw Moore, fake. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for the angel Daniel has arrived to clean the filth and the sinners from this world. Bless his soul. I heard a word, and man will not forget this day or this church, Mother... The Reverend Mother is truly an instrument of the Lord. Amen. Rose Hornsbury, Superior, Wyoming. Well, wait. Why are you fucking with my brother? Oh, can we go in the bathroom? I gotta take a pre-service dump. Oh, it won't let me. I'm gonna wash Better my face, though. First, so I don't scare Daniel. Oh no, it's a cult. Shit, don't let it be a cult. My god, what has Daniel been doing? I know, right? Alright, did you clean up your face? You good now? Good. Now let's look in the That's mirror. Better than nothing. Yeah, we look great. I guess. Wait, we are in a cult? Uh, well, maybe? We haven't figured that out yet. I mean, we are in many. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Wait. No way. Behold, the angel, the angel Daniel? Daniel, Reverend Elizabeth oh, Fisher, invites you to witness the power of the Lord within our own child and church. L live miracles, daily noon and 4 p.m. services, all are welcome. Well, fuck, Daniel, you didn't learn nothing. Nice picture. Wonder if they'll let me in. Wonder how donations can pay for all of this. Do we donate? 
I ain't donating to these guys. They're using our brother. We don't like that. Good. If Daniel's here, at least it won't go viral. EJ has a cult. I am a cult. What the fuck ish is is happening downstairs? What is happening downstairs? A picnic with Daniel? What's going on? Sunday, fun day. Come join Reverend Fisher and the new disciple Daniel for a private picnic. All you can eat barbecue. Limited seats, twenty dollar donation, noon to three PM, May fourteenth, twenty seventeen. A pin box. Okay, I have pretty much the same ones. <laughs> Cute. Loud, screamy people. Mango cult lord. Oh, pin. Hey, Stick it's for pen. charity. Me. Mango cult. Oh lord. We must offer up mangoes. Yes. The mango lord. Dylan, are you going to the picnic with the reverend? Uh, no. I'm. I'm exploring. We're gonna go up top here. We're gonna be faith. sneaky. We hear that word a lot, but faith is not just a word, my brothers and sisters. Oh no. What is faith? Remember Luke 18, 27. What is impossible for man is possible for God. Amen. With that righteous faith comes the salvation of your souls. Can you cross that invisible bridge to salvation? Do you want your soul to be saved, brothers and sisters? Oh yes, you are not like all these sinners out there. So I never asked the Lord for a sign. Then he gave me one. He spoke to me and told me that I was doing right. And to reward our great faith, the Lord sent me the ultimate gift, an angel. A child graced with the power of God. The miracle we have all been praying for, waiting for. Can I get a hallelujah? Hallelujah. Do you have faith in his power? Do you have faith in me? Then please welcome our newest member and our latest miracle, the angel, Daniel. Praise you, Daniel, hallelujah. Oh shit, maybe we should have entered through the back door. Here is Daniel, the prophet who was thrown to the lions by false prophets, but God, saved Daniel so he could do his work. Oh, hallelujah. Yes, Daniel was brought to me to deliver us, Praise to guide me. us from the wilderness Praise to our destiny. Now Daniel will reveal the true power of the Lord. Daniel, we talked about this! Alright, now fuck with them. Flip it upside down and put it back. Daniel is X-Men confirms! <laughs> I love that. Now 
now we have a voice, a messenger. Our flock keeps growing. I see more and more new faces. But this is only the beginning. You must spread the word. Bear witness to this miracle. Thank you so much for coming. And God bless all of you. Amen. Professor X son confirmed. Praise you, Daniel. Fuck away, my Daniel. <clears throat> As our Reverend said, we do appreciate your kind donations. This helps us keep our church and to spread the word of God. Oh yeah, there's only a few tickets left for our picnic raffle next Sunday. Don't miss the child and another miracle. Any questions, please talk to me outside. Bless you for coming today. <laughs> also, thank you everybody who donated points for the Hot Ones Challenge. Uh, for those of you who don't know, the Hot Ones Challenge has been updated. Uh, I will be doing the Hot Ones Challenge when it's completed. However, we will also be getting EJ and Jacob to do the Hot Ones Challenge as well, simultaneously. Hi. Oh, uh, hi. I saw you out in that parking lot earlier. <laughs> yep, that was me. I like to be here too. We can see the whole room, and it's where our reverend mother teaches us classes. <coughs> Whoa. You okay? Need some water? Uh, and no, sorry. I'm just kind of sick. Charity oh, for that hydrate. sucks. Oh, uh, that's too bad. Drink up, bitches. Hey, what happened to your eye? Well, that's a long story. That's okay. My name is Sarah Lee. What's yours? Aw, oh, you must be Jacob's sister. Did you get that letter from Jacob back when he was in California? Yes. <coughs> How did you know he was in California? I was with him. Uh, that's... How we met. You are Daniel's brother? Really? He's always talking about you. Hey, uh, not too loud. Yes, I'm Daniel's brother, but I need some help. The Reverend Mother says we always have to help our neighbor. What do you need? So, can you take me to Daniel? Oh, yes. He's gonna be so happy when he sees you. He missed you so much for his birthday. It will be like a late surprise. Nerd, Ollie, EJ, and... I can't scroll up at the moment. But anybody else who put in points for the Hot Ones Challenge, thank you all. Daniel. You're the living proof of their faith, and mine. I know you understand. I guess, I mean, Sean? Oh my. Sean, you came back. I knew it. You've grown up and I know. Do I look older? What? What happened to your eye? Don't worry, it's okay. Did that happen at the farm? Because of me? I'm so sorry. Kayla, thank I'm you sorry. for the points. It's the It's past. over, Daniel. We just gotta walk on. Does it hurt? No. <laughs> Not as much as your haircut. April, Shut thank up. you for the points. It's different. I kind of like it. Sean, I didn't want to leave you there. Nothing I could do. I was so scared. I even thought you were dead. And... It's okay. We're together now. Yes. So, are you going to stay with us now? Huh? I... 
We still need to go to Puerto Lobos. But we don't need to. We have a new home now. Look. One step at a time, Daniel. Give Sean a chance to process this. I'm sure this is all so overwhelming. By the way, my name is Elizabeth Fisher. We all prayed for your safe return. Sean, yeah, bullshit. you must be a believer now in our Lord, too. Mm. Kind of. Kind of. Daniel told me you had faith. That's how you got here. But first, I need Sarah Lee and Daniel to grab the medicine kit. We have to take care of our new guest. This is a place of healing. Aww. Let's do it later. I want to talk to him now. Daniel? Now. Okay, Reverend Mother. Let's go, Daniel. Whoa, whoa. Hold on. Well, Sean, it's a pleasure to meet you. This is a real blessing today. You were away from Daniel for quite a while. I was in a coma. Of course. <laughs> I wasn't judging you. It sounds like you were judging so me. So what is your plan, Sean? This is a blessed family, and it would be good for Daniel to have you by his side. You should know that the Lord has big plans for him. You mean you have big plans for him? Yeah, God or you? God Fuck off, bitch. Or you? God, of course. I'm his family. Two young boys are not a family. Mark 3, 25. If a house is divided against itself, that house cannot stand. Daniel sounds more like a prisoner than a guest. It saddens me that you see things that way. After everything I've done for him. I know why you're scared, Sean. That's because your heart's full of sins. I know about that poor man you beat down back in Washington, Sean. This is a terrible sin. And until you make penance for it, I can't accept you here. What? Are you serious? I'm sorry, my son. I'm not your son. And Daniel isn't gonna be your golden cow. Daniel, come on! Why don't we ask him what he wants to do? Do not touch me! What the fuck? What did you do? Nothing. Enough. You spilled blood in the Lord's home. Sean! What happened? Your brother came in here, impure and acting like a criminal. But he can be saved, Daniel. I'm sorry, Sean. She's right. I will pray for you. Then, when you're ready, we can. She's trying to manipulate you. Let me lead you to the one true light that never goes out. I want to be your friend. You're crazy. Let's get out of here, Daniel. I want to stay. Just go. There's your answer, Sean. We're together again. So we can go, right? Come on. Get off me, dude. What? Daniel! <coughs> let me go, <laughs> asshole! Daniel! They're not your family! Stop it. You just need to have faith. We'll be waiting. Daniel! It's okay, Sean. Sean. Daniel! What the fuck is happening? Throw a Bible at her like, fuck this bitch. There you go. Satisfied? Now don't you ever come back. I feel like if we get up, we're gonna get beat to shit again. If we do nothing, we're pussies. It makes me angry. I know, right, Kayla? These fucking people are psychos. What do I do here? I need some advice. Ang yeah, yeah, exactly, Angie. 
Beat him down, or at least try. Fight! Alright, so... Are, are we getting up? Yeah, family! Don't make me get Vin Diesel in here. Alright, we're getting up. Come on, kid. Don't make me do this. You're not gonna win. Don't punch me in the eye. Daniel! Daniel! You're pissing me off. This is private property. I have a legal right to stop any intruders. Like you. I just want my brother. But he doesn't want you. He was brought here, and this is where he's staying. Next time, I will not hesitate to use this. Now get out of here. Daniel, hey! Daniel. Sean? Karen? You won't get him back like this. Let's go. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I'm from America, and the gun laws outrage me, too. Yep, this is our mom who abandoned us when we were very, very little, and we haven't seen her all game, and now we have met her. Sean, what happened to your eye? Why the hell are you here? How did you find me? Well, um, I got a letter from uh, Jacob. He said you were missing and that Daniel needed help. I believed him. Hmm. So you finally decided to check on him. You know, Sean, sooner or later, we're going to have to talk. I already have a hotel room. You're gonna need to rest and clean that dressing. What the fuck? A gun? This is kidnapping. You're legit holding him hostage and assault. It's America and why are you surprised? Threats to true thinky gun people. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Ollie, I'm American. I'm outraged. It's just my much. Uh, Karen, oh, I feel you. It's total BS. Oh, what the hell? Now she shows up. I don't write. Why am I buzzed? EJ, you can't be buzzed already. What? How? What? Lady, if you don't get your other son right now, this... And why ain't you getting your kid back, you goof? Lightweight. Yes. I got pee! EJ, you're buzzed so quick. I don't know. EJ is lightweight. I've been getting buzzed fast lately. Well, you get buzzed fast. Just don't get drunk. Pissed again, turning into Hulk. After the bullshit that's going on here, and extreme religious people celebrating and running their mouths, I'm going to go look at something and just listen. Kayla. Man. I love you. Feel better. The, pain away, but the world sucks. But we have each other. Good. Karen seems to be on the move quite often. Holler at me when it's not so triggering and aggravating. I mean, I think we're good until Damn. we go back there. You look bad. Gotta change that dressing soon. Uh, 
How the fuck do I change my dressing? There's no stuff in here. Wonder how long Karen has been here. Did she see one of Daniel's miracles? I know I shouldn't peek, but Condoms. Glad to know she learned the lesson. Diner bills. Karen did her own road trip to get here. Cuevos Rancheros, red style, four fifty. Apple pie, two fifty. You're getting a slice of apple pie for two dollars and fifty cents. Where the hell are you going? Cause I want to go there. Fucking pie is like four dollars, five dollars sometimes. Red's chicory coffee, one ninety five. Total eight ninety five. Tip not included. Road Cafe, Kingman, Arizona. Grilled cheese for three dollars. What the fuck? Where are you getting a grilled cheese for three dollars? I want a grilled cheese for three dollars. You go to a place to get a grilled cheese, you're paying like seven fifty. Cut fries two twenty five. New York cheesecake for two dollars. Holy shit, bud. A slice of New York cheesecake is easily six bucks. And a diet soda for a dollar fifty. That's probably the most accurate one on there. What does that say? Turning forward to look back, making the same choice twice, twice, my solitude days and dreamy nights just to find myself looking forward to turn back K. What else we got in here? Notebook. Damn. Karen does like to capture the world around her. Well, okay, I'll stay till then. Kayla, I'm glad you're still staying. Uh, thanks, April Don't Wife. EJ, take a shot for Jimbo. EJ doesn't have any hard alcohol, which makes me sad. Because uh, I want to take a shot with him. But also, no one's made me take a shot. And Mama Bucks Paula is not here to make me drink. Wife can probably make you one. You're not wrong, Kayla. Uh, dang, she ordered a lot. I want cheesecake. Me too, Ange. I fucking love cheesecake. Uh, yes, I have no whiskey. Yes, I know. I just had a grilled cheese sandwich. Ollie, you didn't share? What the shit? Why? Share when you get some. Oh my god, EJ, go sleep. I've got homemade pigs in a blanket for dinner. And hello, everyone. Hello, Armada. And share. Ollie, eat me. Um, EJ, I will warn you. I will straight up warn you. Do not tell Ollie to eat you, because after the movie that Ollie made me watch, I'm concerned that may happen. So, you reap what you sow, sir. You reap what you sow. Uh, share. Um, later, honey, not on stream. Oh my god. Roar, Armada, send nudes, take a shot. Awesome, thanks, DJ. I'll do that in a minute. Bitch, hello, Leia. I, um, hi, Armada. Hi, April. Um, um, I can't brain no working now. Dylan, I need to show you something. What do you need to show me? Ha ha. Uh, did you watch Fresh? Um, was that the movie? Was that, was that the name of the movie, Ollie? I don't remember. I think it was. Yeah, yeah, Ollie made me watch Fresh. I, I'm assuming you've seen it too, Ange. Ollie going to eat me. Ollie and EJ broke me. Oh, shush, Dylan. Eat, eat, eat EJ. Go pee, Dylan. I made him watch. Yes, of course you did. Always. <laughs> Love it. Yes, it was. I've seen, like, some of it. Yeah, uh, it, 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 it's something. All right. Um, right. I'm going to take a shot. Cheers, EJ. It's something. That's <laughs> that's the only description I could really give of it. 
it's something. Uh, EJ is going to be midsummer in Europe getting eaten by European <laughs> folk. Oh, man. I can't comprehend this. My brain is broken. Whoa. Hey, EJ is mine. Okay, I will eat him alone. Ollie, you must be hungry. Can I get a horny check on Ollie, please? Ollie and EJ, you two officially broke me. 57%. No, there is, that's, that's got to be wrong. That definitely seems low. I feel like Ollie is hornier than that right now. Nine? This is bullshit. I got to pee. Okay. It's back. <laughs> so, wife really wanted me to go to the bathroom so that we, she could put in a new emote. Um, hello everybody, and welcome to the new slouchy emote. Here's my slouching sloth. <laughs> Thank you, wife. Oh, I'm not going to be able to have him because I can't refresh Streamlabs. If, uh, if you don't have it, if you refresh the page, it'll probably be available for you. <laughs> uh, so, uh, just a fun little tip. The chair that I use, uh, wife kind of animated it and made it the chair for the slouching sloth. Uh, I, I think she did a great job. It actually looks pretty good. It, it's pretty accurate. You get the lines from the pillows. Damn, wife. It came out great. I love it. <laughs> I can't have it. I'm not a sub anymore. Who is going to be a fucking legend and gift Kayla a sub? She needs slouching sloth in her life right now. Who is going to be the fucking legend? Who's going to do it? Come on, I know one of you is a legend. I'm confused. It won't let me use it. Try refreshing your page, EJ. Um, oh, Ollie! <laughs> Thanks, Ollie. You're amazing. Ollie, just for that, I'm going to do another shot for you. 29! Let's go! <laughs> Damn Armada. Oh, I only gifted one more to Serene. Let's go. They've gifted 30 in this channel. Let's fucking go, Ollie. Can I get all the love in chat for Ollie? Ansh, enjoy your lurk. Had to make sure it worked. Dylan. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're, you're good, Armada. You're definitely good. Wait. Does the sloth... There, there you go. There you go. We got the sloths. Alright, everybody got their sloths. Everybody good? <laughs> My chat is literally just turned into sloths, and I love it. Uh... Leia, we're not raiding anyone. Armada, thank you for the points. Sloth raid. <laughs> we're all happy about this, wife. We love you. Yes, wife, you did a great job. Came out wonderful. It actually looks really good. Really, so much like my chair. Like, here, hold on. Hold on. 
Let me do this. Oh, wrong one. There we go. See? See? Chair. Chair. Sloth. Chair. Sloth. And then, you know, we're just just casually just like drifting down over time. And then Ollie comes in, does stop slouching. And I got to sit back up. Love it. Oh, thanks, EJ. All right. Chair is chair. You are the sloth. Well, obviously, I'm the sloth, Ollie. Uh, that was for you. I can't slouch like that. It makes my back hurt too much. I get that, Armada. I definitely get that. But I'm not like that. I, I need to slouch. Holy fucking emote, Kayla. We have an emote party in here. All right. I got to get back into this. I'm getting sidetracked. All right. Tracing closer every mile. My heart goes racing. Sore. I remember. Know the feeling. There's no fighting back that beating. Tearing apart my core. Early morning blues. Coffee. Red-eyed truckers and sad families. Bad eggs. Not the waitress's fault. She's a quick, hurried one. Probably ending a long night shift. Tag says Clementine. 22-ish. Redhead dyed brunette. Eyes, eyebrows, and skin tone don't lie. Irish descent. Owner's daughter, maybe. Mahoney's. Vague, polite smile. Busy mind. Mildly clumsy. Looks distracted. Anxious. Young cook called Clem Clemmy? Clemmy. Brother. Boyfriend. Boyfriend. Apologies. When the orders are late and she's the one getting roasted. Do mom and dad know you're dating on the job, Clemmy? Mixing up work and love seldom makes a good match. That's a brand new baby bump under the stained apron. It's 2017 and young folks are still busy making babies. I guess nothing really ever changes. What do you think? People are going to give up fucking? Alright. That was her notebook. Alright, we're done in there. Let's move on with our life. Church flyer. Fuck that church. So Karen did check it out. Wonder if she saw Daniel in action. I want everyone to put sloths when I yell for no slouch. Yes, that's, that's the rule. Anybody in chat who's here, when Ollie does no slouching or stop slouching, has to throw in the sloth emote. Uh, trash pandas. Yes, trash pandas. I've been beaten up too much by a thousand pound animals to slouch. Well, that's because you are an awesome farm boy, Armada. Good job, wife. Amazing job. You got it, Ollie. All the sloths. Alyssa is the best. The emotes are so cute, and you catch up every dumb idea I have, and I love you so much, smooches. Oh, Ollie, can we have a Mango Lord emote? <laughs> a Mango Lord emote? Like a mango with a red king coat. Oh, like the cape? Like a red cape on the, on the Mango Lord? That's a rule now. Farm boy for the win. You're not wrong. Sunday, fun day. Come join Reverend Fisher and the new disciple Daniel for a private picnic. All you can eat barbecue. Limited seats. Twenty dollar donation. What do you mean twenty dollar donation? You gotta fucking give a donate. It that defeats the purpose of a goddamn donation. Donation is supposed to be out of the kindness of your heart. You're not supposed to be forcing people to give you a goddamn donation. All right, moving on. Noon to three p.m. May fourteenth, twenty seventeen. All right, let's go. Oh, well, let's not go. Fuck that place. What else is in here? We got a Bible. I really should finish reading this someday. I really should finish reading this someday. No, we're trying to open the drawer. A casino token. We got a dollar. EJ, when are you coming back to visit so we can go to, uh... The casino again? Karen's always into low tech. Seat for donation. I think it sounds the fair. Back then. Right. That, that, that's, that's rigged. A donation is supposed to be out of the kindness of your heart. Huh. This isn't her tablet. Struggles with too many apps open, but should be okay for basic browsing slash Jello Cat. Jello Cat? 
password is 112708. Hope you find your son. 708. Yay, technology. She came prepared. Holy shit. Welcome to your new life at the Universal Uprising Ch Church Haven Point. Therefore, go and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and all of the Son and the Holy Spirit, and teaching them to obey everything I have commanded you. And surely I am always with you. I am with you always and to the very end of age. Matthew 28, 19-20. Mission, accept the Lord, spread the word, Jesus, keep faith of the community to seek and save the lost. Luke 19, 10. A message from the Reverend Mother Elizabeth Fisher. As a pastor of our holy church, I have devoted my life and love to the teachings of the gospel and our Lord, and I was blessed since childhood to be giving this calling, and it is my privilege to spread the word and preside over this loving, righteous community of Haven Point. I look forward to meeting each and every one who seeks out our humble refuge. Together we will begin the journey as to a new life guided by the spirit of the Lord and Savior. Bless you all. Haven Point Community, Haven Point, Nevada is a living oasis where individuals and families can live out their faith in a community dedicated to the teachings of Christ. All who share our faith are welcome to join us and build a bridge to the Lord and his eternal estate. Hospitality, beloved, it is a thing, a faithful thing you do in all your efforts for all these brothers, strangers as they are. 3 John 1, 5 Gratitude. This is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Psalm 118.24 Forgiveness. Get rid of all the bitterness, rage, and anger, brawling, and slander, along with every form of malice. Be kind and compassionate to one another, forgiving each other, just as Christ God forgave you. Ephesians 4.31-32 Holy shit, bud. What about boobies? Ollie's talking about boobies. Horny chat. Chat is 77. Per yeah, chat is definitely horny night. What the shit is going on? I love all the degeneracy while Dylan is reading about this church's BS. I mean, the fuck? I love how EJ keeps replying to his own message. You drunkie. Psst, Ollie, I am waiting. Uh, that was the point. We had to bounce things out, Alyssa. Uh, okay, a bunch of Pokemon stuff. All right, good. We're moving on. Uh, yeah, uh, Armada sound alerts aren't on right now. Reverend Mother doesn't look too humble. Holy fuck. A Slice of Haven Point by Robert Neal. One of the great mysteries in Nevada is how it balances the Holy Spirit with the Holy Dollar. Few tourists travel from around the world to seek religion here, but in the tight-knit Christian community of Haven Point, Nevada, a charismatic pastor has inspired a devout following. As she told me in an interview at her peaceful church office, Reverend Elizabeth Fisher has spent her whole life as a humble disciple of the Lord, feeling the call to share his love and glory in this dark age. I had a powerful experience as a child, but that put me on the righteous path. She smiles gently and touches my hand, but this is not about me or my story, as anybody in our wonderful church can tell you. And they tell and tell me they did. The members of the Universal Uprising Church speak with hushed awe of their pastor and how she inspires them. Reverend Fisher just wants to share her blessings with us, says Corey Johnson, 34, a recent addition to the congregation. I was pretty cynical before I went to one of her revivals. You could really feel the electricity when she spoke. People were crying, including me. Looks like a roach motel. Hot Dog but Man Mustard Party 2. Yeah. Will find me there. Cheap Motel, Haven Port, Nevada, Sand Snake Motel, 1181 Brandy Highway, Blue Rock, Nevada, ratings 2 star, reviews, Una F, beds are super uncomfortable but it's cheap, Mark D, nice pool but dusty as fuck, Alice G, nice roadside motel, cool staff, fantastic. Alright. Uh, what else was I missing here? Holy shit. Damn, I can't prank anybody then. Nope, you can't. You refunded Armada one point? You, you literally refunded Armada one fucking channel point? 
Why? At least well, what is wrong with you? Rampados Rampardos has been caught by Armada, Different Wife, now. and Ange. Let's go. You three rock. I didn't think anyone refunded me last Friday. Sweet one whole point. Ha ha. Armada, Alyssa, and Ange. I really wanted the Rampardos. Now I have him forever. I did the Pokemon alert last Friday. Don't make fun of me. Autopilot mod brain. Well, enjoy that one fucking point, bud. I need to finish my beer. Be right back. We'll find out. Ah, <sighs> what do you say? Popped in, out for supplies. I'll grab some food in case you want to eat. New socks and shorts in the bathroom. All yours if they fit. Might be a good time to contact Jacob. His number is on the letter he sent. Be right back, Karen. Holy shit. Jeez. What the fuck is this it shit? It only took Supermom eight years to give a shit. Dear Mrs. Diaz, my name is Jacob, and I worked with your son, Sean, and Daniel on a farm in California. They were the same... There, there were some problems, and Sean went missing. I'm with Daniel now in Haven Point, Nevada. He gave me this P.O. Box address, so I, if I, if you get this... Holy shit, but I can't read tonight. P.O. Box address, so if you get this, I think Daniel might be in danger. He needs help to get out of here. I can tell you more if you contact me at this number, 775-555-0118. Please hurry. Thank you, Jacob. Holy fuck, bud. I would need eight years to be able to read that. What the fuck? I know, right? English. English. I'm doing fairly well tonight, considering everything. All right. We're going to peek place outside. This is quite remote. Good. Ange, enjoy your lurk. Be looking for me here. Oh, got to draw. I got a few moments to myself, so let's practice. <sighs> okay, just draw now. Don't think about anything else. Got a good picture of it. I'm ready to draw. You got this, Dylan. It's just been a long week. It definitely has, April. But we're here now. It's Friday. We got... I guess that's an okay start. This fucking awesome game tonight. I can keep going. We got Kingdom Hearts and EJ tomorrow. Or should we say Mango Lord? Mango Lord EJ? I can see myself stopping by this motel during a road trip. <laughs> We Didn't got a good fucking weekend ahead of us, everybody. I gotta call Ange's boss These tomorrow really and me. tell them to not have Ange work all weekend, cause that's unfair. Oh, he drawing a fucking I dragon. Who lives around here. It's so wild and. Or is that a tentacle monster? Or what the fuck did all you right. just draw? Back to reality, dude. Let's go, yeah! Oh yeah, it's Friday, isn't it? I lost track. It is definitely Friday, Armada. What do you got planned for the weekend? I'm not going out. Better Things wait for Things just got later. weird. <laughs> You've come a long, long way, buddy. Backpack. This thing is killing my back. Hey! Hey, I Brody gave us back. Bruises. Brody was the shit. I miss that dude. Brody was a true fucking MVP. Holy shit, we got so many more pages. Oh wait, maybe not as many as I thought. Blah. Flores tried to frame me again. Can't blame her for trying. Okay, it was a picture we drew in the hospital. Alright, snuck out of the hospital through the window. Wasn't easy with only one eye. Didn't realize how fucking high up it was. Maybe I, it helped. Aw, shit. I am... So not fit for the trip. Headaches are killing me. Have no cash. No nothing. Chased by so many ghosts. But gotta focus on what's most important. Reach Nevada. Find Daniel. Yes. 
so so hard to drive fucking miracle i haven't been in the wreck yet gonna pull over soon so i could rest driving in the dark with one eye is the absolute worst i would feel a lot safer walking on the edge of a cliff on a moonless night racist dickheads beat the shit out of me because i wouldn't let them humiliate me my whole body hurts stomach lums but i don't care did i say lums lungs but i don't care my only priority is to find daniel no more gas gotta walk end of the road no may 11th 2017 got picked up by a trucker not far away from haven point i was nervous but the guy was sweet even hooked me up with a sandwich really needed that boost thanks anton you were the man reminder don't get into fucking trucks with random people Okay, Daniel has been rain brainwashed by a cult. He wants to stay with them, and I fucked up with this reverend. I fell right into her trap. I'm so stupid. Also, Karen, what the fuck is she doing here? How did she find us? Don't want anything from her. Nada. And there's the picture I just drew. All right, we're all caught up. What do we got in here? Got some souvenirs. Fantastic. All right. Uh... I gotta fight Ange's boss tomorrow. Yes, we should all arrive and fight Ange's boss. I agree. Uh, I don't think I'll be on EJ's stream tomorrow. I work tomorrow and Tyler will be here. Kill it. That's unfortunate. But if you do get an opportunity, feel free to hop in there. It's going to be a good time. I don't know. I might try and go out with the girl I had a date with yesterday. Armada, I heard you had a sweet date and that's awesome. So enjoy yourself. We met, we'll miss you, Kayla. Ooh, Armada. Yes, Armada. That's great. We always miss Kayla when she's not here. Yes. Wow, what an older sibling. Aw, oh, I learned on Dylan's stream that it's okay to trust truckers if they offer you a sandwich. April, that is not what we learned here today. Like, yes. Okay. In this instance, it was okay. You know, the trucker, he, he gave us a ride. We gave, we, he gave us a sandwich. He, he, he let us have a nap. But in normal instances, I would absolutely not say to get into a truck with a random stranger, even if he offers you a sandwich and then tells you to take a nap. Everything about that was sketch. Yes, but sandwich. <laughs> God <laughs> damn it, April. <laughs> you are too harmless for this. Holy shit. All right, this let's look at this road map. Way too big. Oh, that was it. Wait, can I go back in there? I looked at everything over here. Looked in the drawer, look on the tablet. Jacob's letter, Karen's note. Door, we can't go out. Phone? Call Jacob. Oh, I should call Jacob. It's probably a good idea. Time to hit up Jacob. Actually, let's let's go back in here. Is there stuff in here? I just said there was clothes and stuff in here for me, right? Where's the clothes? Look, nothing. Oh, maybe we're already wearing the clothes. I think we're already wearing the clothes. But sandwich. Oh, we love you, April. <laughs> so if we are harmful, we can get it. Dylan is a bat. What? What? Let's make the truck driver eat our sandwich and take a nap. Yes, that's how it should happen. It said to call Jacob. Still can't believe my I was exploring. I don't pay attention. We're calling Jacob. Jacob! Hello? Jacob, it's me, Sean. Yeah. Where are you? You have to come here, Sean. I know. I'm not far. In a motel. Good. Listen, I, I can't talk right now. I gotta go. Wait! Daniel, how's he doing? Meet me tomorrow afternoon on Brandy Highway. There's a, a, a junction just above Haven Point. There's a, a, a wild mice ranch billboard there. I'll be there at four. Jacob, wait! I can't talk, Sean. Alright, that was sketch. 
Damn. Jacob! He couldn't really talk. <sighs> no, oh, I called Jacob. So, messed up. so we do that and the driver crashes. Yes, Kayla. I need this Jacob as a sound alert for real. Wild Mice Ranch. Do they only have mice there? They might. Who ate for Karen? Um, Use the tablet again. Let's let's she came prepared. I don't I wanna no, I don't I don't Looks I, like a road I wanna play games on a tablet. But Ooh, nobody will key find chain. there. I want a keychain. Kinda pretty. Wonder if she made it. No, I wanted that. Is there anything else in here? Oh. Do I just have to wait for Karen now? God damn it, Karen. Can I go outside? I wanna go outside! Can I look outside? Is there anything out there? There ain't shit out here. Oh, we're in room 11. I don't know if that's relevant, but I know it now. Should we read the Bible? Right, I guess we'll wait for Karen. That's a lot of mice. I needed 20 just to run my computer. Damn, that's Let's a lot of mice. Let's just while I wait for her. If she comes back. Wait, where's Jacob? Someone call Jacob. Hey, sorry it took so long. Oh, Fuck what'd you get us? Packed. How are you feeling? <sighs> Nothing broken? Alter boys don't fight fair? Yeah. I'm okay. Double cheese, no onion. Right? That'll do. Oh, that burger looks sexy. Got you some gauze and uh, antibacteria stuff for your eye. Mm. Hey, don't wolf that down. Or at least oh, take a breath. I want that burger in my face. <sighs> like you care. Oh shit, there's Sean. a growlith. I do. <sighs> Come on, Karen. Don't act all hurt. It's too late. Where were you when I broke my leg when I was 13? Not with me. When Daniel got a bad flu a couple years ago, he didn't sleep next to him every night. Where were you? Where were you? Fair enough. So let's talk, because we do have to get your brother out of a cult. I'm listening. Oh, it is a cult! How did you two Y'all were right! On the road for that long? We just got lucky and got some help along the way. Total strangers. We even had our own little family. Good. How did you go to Beaver Creek? You know, I don't have to answer your questions, right? You're right. So tell me what you want from me, Sean. Nothing, Karen. I mean, what do you want from me? A fucking hug? Hey, I just want you to know what I did and why. If you care. So, ask me anything. Uh, I need to get ready soon before Tyler gets here. Also, I need to take out the garbage. Twinkies. Wait, where are the Twinkies, April? Bye, Kayla. I'll be getting off in 20 minutes. Puppers. Fire dog. Uh, yes, Armada. Where do I get the legendary Pokemon at? That's a good question. I wish I knew. Told you I want a Zapdos. Church with a fence around, and you're surprised as a cult. I'm innocent, Ollie. You know this. Like I am, I am. Like, look, look just read the shirt. Just, just read the shirt. I'm, I'm super innocent. Like, no harm ever, anywhere, ever, existence. So how would I know it's a cult? I don't know things. I just, yeah. Growlithe has been caught by Armada, April, Kayla, and myself. Let's go. We fucking rock. I want a Lugia. That'd be sick. Uh, yes, I caught the fire dog. Yay, congrats, everybody. Hell yeah, guys. Bullshit. 
You're not fucking shit up, Dylan. I fuck lots of things up. Uh, yeah, where are the Twinkies? That's a good question. You called out Twinkies. Be right back, mom calling. Okay, you got it, Kayla. You are not innocent. I am 100% innocent, at least until you made me watch Fresh. What have I missed? Uh, not a whole lot. We're still in the hotel room. I am having a struggle right now. We are in a cult. Yes. Well, no, we're not in a cult. Daniel's in a cult, and we need to rescue Daniel from the cult. All right. Why did you bail on us? I wasn't meant to be a wife. Or a I need mother. more beer. I thought I was supposed to. Cheers. I tried to pretend for many years. But this Twitch chat cat is. And the urge chat. to leave just became unbearable. Does I had Twitch no other choice. chat count as a cult? Are you serious? Good question. You chose this life. You fell in love. You made your own choices, right? Making your own choices doesn't mean you can never fool yourself, Sean. Escape After the cult. Daniel, yes. You were about eight, and Esteban's garage was getting busy. There was so much going on around me, yet somehow I just felt that my own life was just slipping away. Felt like an empty shell. Sean, it was the hardest decision I ever made. I knew I might never see you all again, but I took that responsibility. Yeah, you honestly didn't miss a whole lot. I read for like 10 minutes straight. So many words came out of my mouth, and it, it I don't even know how I said half of them. Um, cult of degeneracy. Yeah, we are a cult of degeneracy. And enjoy your lurk again. You know, it makes my heart so happy to see Dylan freak out about the things I said. What? What did you What did you say? What did I miss? Well, we're not in a cult. You You said we were in a cult. Also, April, no. You cannot hitchhike for free sandwiches. Stop it. Stop hitchhiking for sandwiches. It doesn't work. Level four reading. Yes. Did dad know about all of this? I was honest with your father. We did family therapy, but it wasn't about him. It was me. He was heartbroken for months after you left. Years. I was too. I was in love with your father. He was the best person I ever met. But just not enough for you. Something was missing from the equation, yeah. I was. Team Fortress 2 looking for sandwiches. Is that a thing? Oh man, so happy right now. Hitchhiking. Stop with the hitchhiking for sandwiches! What is wrong with you guys? We've gone over this. You cannot hitchhike for sandwiches. God damn it. The heavy from TF2 eats sandwiches. I don't know what that is. What are you doing here? So what exactly are you doing in Nevada? You live around here? No. I'm uh, way out in Arizona. Sean, I told you. Your friend uh, Jacob wrote my P.O. box and said Daniel was in trouble. That's it. Arizona? Holy shit. It's just lizards and rocks. Yes, I found something there. New York didn't really do me good, so. Yeah, okay. Think I've heard enough. I didn't have a choice, Sean. We only have one life. And I didn't want mine to be spent in regrets. For years, I fooled myself. Thinking I'd find satisfaction into what society expected me to be. And that was my mistake. I hope someday you can understand that. But I never stopped caring about you. For what it's worth, I am sorry for hurting you and Daniel and Esteban. I know you are, Karen. That still doesn't change the way I feel. 
Of course not. Uh, I know I can't change the past, Sean. I don't think you would. I need some air. I'm just gonna go chill outside barefoot. Reflect on our life choices here for a hot minute. Sean, whatever you want to say to me, this is the time. Let's just get it all out in the open. See what happens. We need transportation and food. God damn it, April. God, I need to see that YouTube video. Dylan explaining half an hour not to hitchhike. Raging, I'll pass on the hitchhiking sandwich. Don't trust the ingredients. That's right. Listen to nerd. Just be like nerd. Why can't you be like nerd? Just no. We live for the thrills, but I like the lizards from Arizona. Bitch said, fuck them kids. I'm Audi. She's probably hitchhiked for sandwiches. This bitch probably did hitchhike for sandwiches. True. He's dressed like a hobo. We are on the run. We got no clothes. We find what we wear. I don't think my laptop likes the temperatures out here. Lurky. April, enjoy your lurky. I need a new chair. Mine's about to fall apart. Uh, get a little fan for it. Nerd is too great. We can't compare to the amazing nerd. Ollie, that is a good idea. Nerd will make you sandwiches. Nerd, I would eat a sandwich from you. I don't know about half the other people in here, but I would eat one of your sandwiches. I mean, I get you wanted to leave and stuff. Okay, but why would you ghost us like that? Not even a fucking birthday card. I just... I thought if I vanished, you would all move on. But I wanted to contact you guys so many times. I almost did. But you wanted a clean break from us. I didn't want to be a part-time, pissed-off mother. Not fair to any of you. I left when Daniel was still very young, so he wouldn't remember me. Cool plan, Mom. You heard Daniel way worse. He thought you took off because of him. I know. I hope I can make it up to you, Daniel, someday. I can start by getting his ass out of that church, cult, whatever. So, did you ever actually miss us? Or Dad? Of course, Sean. I do miss your father. He had such a big heart. He could brighten up a rainy day. That was like his superpower. But above all, I miss watching you grow up. See how you saw the world. I miss sharing these moments with you, Sean. Well, that's your loss. I don't know. God damn it, Ollie. But I mean it. Uh. Dylan had a burger that had two grilled cheeses. Oh, that was a slamming burger. Oh, I would do things oh. for that right now. What I, did I you would do definitely do things for that right now. 
I pursued that some was dreams Kimberger. and failed. Ollie, thank you for the stop Learned slouching. Lessons. I guess all this time I tried to find out what really matters to Which me. Which doesn't involve a husband and two kids. It does to a lot of people, and I totally respect that. Just not to me. I wasn't good at making plans, which is what most of modern life is about, right? School, job, marriage. Asked my mom and dad. They wanted me to follow their rules, their faith. Oof, I tried, but I wanted to find my own way, with no security blanket. Family, religion, social norms. It's just all about security. Fuck, I gotta pee. But it all just looked like a sweet golden jail to me. I tried to escape that. Nerd would make slamming sandwiches. You have it on a little standing thingy. It helps my laptop stay cool as well. I eat sandwiches all alone. I'm not sharing. Ollie? Ollie, I will eat your sandwich. Get over here and give me your sandwich. It's on my lap right now, but a little stand would be great. The sun is also on it. Grilled cheese is really good. A chat, get ready. All the slar cheese. Dillner burger with two grilled cheese on it. That's bun. I love this emo. Yes. It's a great emo. It's fantastic. Uh, sounds really good. It's called the Nerd Sandwich. Black Forest Ham, smoked turkey, a little bit of oven bake bacon with American and Swiss cheese, sun dried tomatoes, and a little uh, Dijon mustard. Holy shit, bud. That's a sandwich. Hey, Rogers fixed our bill. Let's go. Armada, it looked really good. It was really good. Hello, I hope it's a good day. Wolfie! Wolfie, I'm slightly intoxicated, and we are playing Life is Strange 2, episode 4. We are having a good time. Uh, hello, I hope it's a good day. Oh, I read that already. Uh, I ate it. Also, I will slap you in the penis if you touch my sandwich. Do not touch my penis, but I will touch your sandwich. Uh, ooh, I love ham and Swiss. Yes, classic. Wolfie. All right, I got pee. I'll be right back. We'll continue this in a second. All right, I'm back. Hello. What's going on? What'd I miss? All right. Um, um, uh, do, 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 do. slightly intoxicated, slightly luminous has appeared, slightly. I will share my sandwich with wife only. All right, I'll, I'll accept that. Ollie, I feel so special. Fine, Ollie, I will make my own sandwich. A uh, bunch of emotes, blah, blah, blah. Uh, good, make me one then too. Uh, LOL. No, you're sharing yours with wife. I'm only going to make one for Dylan, EJ, and our Armada, you're the fucking man. Ooh, chili dogs, yes. Today my boyfriend and I will be having chilled chili dogs. Ah, uh, Wolfie, can you come over? I, I, I'll cook for, for you and your boyfriend, and you, you can hang out with wife and I, and we can make chili dogs. Um... Does that sound slamming? Chili cheese dogs, please. Yes. Doesn't salsa and chips sound so good right now? It really does, EJ. Fuck, I'm getting some. Also, I have chips and salsa, but I haven't opened them yet. They're very good. Ooh, EJ, yummy. Wife, let's eat the sandwiches like Lady and the Tramp. That's hot. Uh, ooh, Ollie, okay. I'm just trying to get wife smooches. I mean, who's to say? Uh, wait, I heard chili cheese dogs. Yes, Wolfie and her, uh, her boyfriend are having chili cheese dogs. Uh, Dylan needs some chili dogs. He's intoxicated. I mean... That sounds really good, honestly. Oh, that sounds cute. I'm making him a delicious armada. Ooh, what's the delicious? I don't even remember where we left off here. Uh... We'll go with worth it. Yeah. Surprise Hope delicious. It was worth it. It was. For now, I've found my place in the world with like-minded people. Nuggies! I'm at peace with my fuck-ups and my decisions. How do you make peace with bailing on your parents, your husband, and your kids? I know, that's hard to understand. But I think people should know who they are. Not fake it for anybody. <sighs> Whatever. You sound so 
care less. It's like you can't even realize how much pain you've caused. I do care. That's why I'm here. To help you and your brother. If I didn't step up to help him now, I couldn't live with myself. EJ, enjoy your lurky. Eating chips and salsa and watching. EJ, enjoy your chips and salsa. Also, share. Hey, hey, give me one of those. Hey, um... Give me a smoke. Mind if I bum a smoke? Sure. Still got a few left. EJ, have you seen what wife did? I'm making him a delicious drunky food. Oh, get back, you turkey. Wow. Eating chips and salsa while Have watching is so ages? cute. Yes. Dad loved that thing. I know. Only thing I have left of his. Armada, this is not fresh. We talked about fresh earlier. No, oh, man. Esteban hated when I saw Ali, stop turning people into fucking cannibals. You didn't want me to die and- Kayla, welcome that. back! Fuck. Life can be so cynical sometimes. I remember he would smoke sometime. Long ago. We didn't fight much. But when we did... I would go out on the porch and light up so I could calm down. Esteban would come over and ask for a drag. And I would just look up at the sky and watch the stars, or the planes. I do miss that. I used to do the same thing with my best friend, Lila. Smoking on the porch, just letting time go. That's when you know someone is good to you. When you can just sit together, <laughs> shut the hell up, and watch the universe do its own thing. Oh no, spinning wheel of death. No, stop it. Kayla! No wonder Ollie likes cannibals. Yes, Ollie is friends with cannibals. Uh, that's why when we were playing The Forest yesterday, uh, I kept making a reference to Ollie being friends with cannibals. Not me as a an actually vegetarian eating most times vegan that's taking a pause because health reasons at the moment taking people into cannibals wait 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 hold on a minute ollie are you telling me are you trying to tell me that you were turning people into cannibals while you yourself do not eat any meat whatsoever are we, are we gonna have are we gonna have a problem here? You and I are gonna have to have words after this, Ollie. Living vicariously through them. Oh, so you're a wannabe cannibal. For being vegan, do you love mushrooms? We can bond over those. Wolfie, I love mushrooms. Mushrooms are fucking slamming. I especially like deep fried mushrooms because they're they're just really good. We're just having a casual jam session and talking about mushrooms. This is great. I like mushrooms, but the texture upsets my brain. Cry. I get that. That's a whole mood. I do love shrooms. Mushy rooms. I even eat them raw in salads. I don't know that I go that far. I like them on burgers. I like a portobello mushroom patty. Uh, I like the deep fried mushrooms. I like sauteed mushrooms. But I don't know that I'd eat them raw. I guess if I was hungry, maybe. All right, we're going inside. We should go back inside. We gotta move on with our lives. Deep fried are good I because the texture is pretty much moitered. Okay. Let's go. Moitered. Yes, I had to pronounce that correctly and say moitered. Alright, Mom, what'd you buy for me? Did you get me cool stuff? But they are good raw. 
Ollie, if you can convince me to eat raw mushrooms, I'd be impressed. Sean, I know I can't change the past. Or what I did. But this is about helping your brother. You gotta trust me this one time. I've eaten morel mushrooms raw before. Wife is like, I must go with the shroom talk. I like mushrooms on pizza and now in grilled cheese. Oh my god, Kayla. A truffle grilled cheese with mushrooms in it? Yes. Ew, fungus. Oh, hey, Paula. I like cooking them and putting them in spaghetti or a mo or the most, the most or on pizza. Holy shit, words are hard. I will tell you to close your eyes and shove them into your mouth and run. God damn it, Ollie, that's not going to help. I know. Hey, Paula. It's still hard. But yes, we have to be a team to rescue Daniel. We can do it. Okay. How? We need to get in touch with this Jacob. He obviously knows a lot more than us about the church. Well, I called him when you were out. We can meet with him tomorrow. Okay, good. I also got these, just in case. Walkie talkies. Okay. What do you think this is? A spy take mission? Care of the eye. So, do you need any help with that? The doubters is here. Oh, hey, how's it going? What's up, Paula? It may not help you, but it helps me. God damn it, Ollie. Someone tell me I shouldn't start another two and a half hour film. Mel, don't do it. Uh, wife, I get that. I hate peas, but the texture bothers me the post. Sensory issue. Kayla, I understand that. Why not? Hi, PP and Mel. What movie, Mel? Ollie, because it's midnight. It's one for me. That's no excuse. It will be Attack of the Clones. It's weekend. Hi, nerd. Go watch. True Ollie. Mel, do it. Shrooms. Yes, shrooms. Hello, Paula and Mel. Hello, everybody. What's going on? Uh, what are we doing? Sure. Yes. yes. Thanks. So, you feel like telling me the story here? Yes, Ange, let's time. have shrooms. Ollie, it's already okay. started. Paula, Mel, Kayla. Wait, are we having a giant mushroom party? Because I'm down for that. We should call John. Yes. Hello, everyone. Hi, Mel. Mel, how was your first movie? What did you watch? Did you enjoy it? Did you have a good time? Can we offer you a shroom, Paula? Hi, Mel. Ange, would you like some shrooms as well? We're, do we're all doing shrooms right now, apparently. I don't eat fungus. Paula, you don't have to pretend to eat it. Just, just close your eyes and you'll eat it. You won't even know that you ate it. Do you eat fun guys, Paula? Ha! <laughs> Shroom party! Yes. Here, try this on. I'm a lurk. Episode 2 just started. Grown up Anakin time. Mel, enjoy. How do I look? Oh, we got an eye patch Great. now. We're a fucking pirate. Thank you, Karen. Big day tomorrow, so we should get some rest. Yeah. I'm ready to get Daniel. Hell yeah, Paula. Reasons why I have high expectations of men and women. Star Wars. Facts. Meeting point the next day. An Ammonite! Oh, fuck shit! Catch it! How do I do that? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, the Steam Summer Sale. I got an email for it. No. Sure stop, show up. stop distracting me. He better. Pokemon. He better. Catch. Well, if he doesn't find us, we'll find him. 
Alright, got the Pokemon. I Shit, I'm out of balls! You guys have been through. Makes me want to punch in the face each and every asshole that got in your way. Yeah. Good thing we got to meet amazing people, too. Life on the road is all about that. The sweet encounters. Hope I can see them again someday. There we go. Oh, Alright, we're good. So tell me about Daniel. What's he like? Well, he's definitely special. Hope so. He's your brother, right? Heads up. Is that him? Yep. Wait here. Sean! What happened? Oh, hey, it's Jacob. Jacob! Um, before we accuse him... Jake, I'm not mad, but you better explain everything. I didn't know where else to go. Listen, I, I saw Daniel come back to the camp that night. Like, he was in shock or something. Then I heard all these sirens, and I got scared. I just, I packed a few things, I, I took a blanket from your tent, and we, we left together. I also kept the cash you made on the farm. Uh, it's in my car. You did right, Jake. Thank you. You have no idea what he looked like when I found him that night, Sean. He was in bad shape, with a gunshot wound, and all by himself. I, 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 I couldn't just leave him there. What about the others? Hannah, Penny, what happened to them? They, they ran over to Merrill's place when they found out Finn and Cass were gone. That was the last time I saw them. Then on our way out here, Daniel told me more about what happened that night. How scared he was. The blast. Daniel feels he's got to redeem himself for what he did. I need to get to him, Jacob. He's not guilty of anything. I should have protected him better. I'm telling you to be careful with the Reverend Mother. She's waited her whole life for somebody like Daniel. The Reverend knows how to manipulate people. She's good at this. He wants to stay with her. Daniel has faith in the Reverend now. Yeah, not afraid of that Lisbeth of yours. I'm getting Daniel out of here. Uh, come on. There's no way they're going to let you take him away. Well, too bad. We're not going to ask for their permission. You must be Jacob. I'm Karen. Hi. Okay. I don't know if you want to do this, but I, I have an idea. I think school must be over by now, but Lisbeth will stay at the church with Daniel for his special classes. That'll give us time to sneak into the compound before we get to them. I'll be on the lookout. Keep watch in case it all goes to shit. Sean, stay on the walkie. Sounds like a plan. One more thing. I, uh, we have to get my sister, too. Sarah Lee. <laughs> really, Jacob? Come on, man. She's with your parents. I know. Please, listen, Sean. <sighs> She's not safe here. She's sick. They believe in everything Elizabeth says. And she says she'll cure Sarah with prayers. I know you understand, right? Damn, Jake. We need his help too, Sean. Okay, Jake. I'm listening. Elizabeth knows what's wrong with Sarah Lee. We just, we need to find her medical record. I think it's in her home office. 
Then I'll go get Sarah Lee while you get Daniel. Okay? Fine. Sure. I'm gonna trust you on this, Jacob. All good for you, Karen. What if Daniel won't go with you? He will. I know him. Just a random fucking meeting spot in the goddamn middle of nowhere on a fucking highway. <laughs> that was for you guys. Enjoy. So it's just a random flock of birds up there. Anyone else see that? Or was that just me? <laughs> that was also for you guys. Alright, what I miss? Uh, Ammonite has been caught by Nerd. Nerd 1. Let's go, Nerd! Check up! Yay, Nerd! Pokey greatness. I need this sound alert. Ollie, I will work on that. Uh, I am ready for bed and had a very long day, so keeping up with chat okay. is difficult, and I will lurk now until I fall asleep. Leia, get Don't a good night's sleep. Be careful, Sean. Got it. Thanks. We gotta be careful now. If anything happens... Good night, Leia. Talking, good night, okay? Leia. For some yeah, reason, I thought course. Jacob was the angry asshole from the Let's truck at the farm, over. but I guess that was, that was EJ, right. I guess. Damn it, EJ. Right Heart. So Kayla, why did out. you assume the angry asshole okay. was Jacob? Good night, Leia. Good night, sure Leia. Will have those files because on I sister? thought that was his name. Jakey Wakey. Jakey. Oh, shit. Shut up. How many? I'm talking to people. Just three. A man with his kid on one side and a woman alone on the other. Got it. Thanks. People aren't supposed to come and go around the church once the service is over. Better to avoid them if we can. Can I go this way? I want to explore over here. Uh, Jakey Wakey, Jakey, I think it was Eric. For how long do you keep on streaming? Uh, until this episode's over, Raleigh. I feel like we're close to the end, though, so... I don't think there's too much left here. Uh, Sarah Lee Bread, well, that was well brought up, Dylan. Thanks. So were you. So... Um... Is wife Did making a map for a game in the no. background? I'm intrigued. In wife, what are you doing back there? Community back east. When Elizabeth came out here to start Haven Point, my folks followed her and brought me along. Hmm. Uh, she's doing a death run Must in Fortnite Armada. Kinda. Eight-year-olds don't want to go to church all day. Where are you going? There's people there. We need to avoid the people you said. Okay, cuz I'm struggling. Ollie, why are you struggling? Hugs and smooches. Oh, damn. Ollie, you getting lucky tonight? Uh, that's a bush. Can you go around the bush? Jacob, get out of my way. I gotta go this way. That bitch is on guard over here. We gotta go down here. Okay. There it is. Looks empty. Let's hope so. Luckily for us, we never close our door. But closed doors. Enter! Can't believe Sending you hugs really and smooches, Ollie. Ah, oh, right. House. I'm still sick oh. and I can't sit long. We did it. Ollie, feel better. Now we have a little bit more time. Yes, we do. Nice work. So where are the files? Right there, in her office. Oh, of course it's locked. Her open door speech is just another lie. Gotta find a way in. Fuck. Think there's a key somewhere? Maybe she's too cautious not to have a spare set around. All right, let's look around oh, up in this bitch. Whoa. Damn. Yeah, painting. This is so artless. Are you okay, Jake? Ollie, how's yeah. your daughter feeling? Yeah, no. It, it's just Kick the door down. So That's the way to do it. Full of a book. Confide and convince. Fifteen evenings in here must be so much fun. Nothing on the couch. Nothing in a chair. Nothing in the living room. Nothing over here. Anything in the kitchen. A paper. The moat and the bean. New morning family practice. 
John Robert, MD, Sweet 254, Blue J Lane, Sparks, Nevada, 555-693, MNG. Patient name, Elizabeth Fisher. Prescription antibiotics for a yeast infection, 250 milligrams twice daily. Advol for stress and anxiety, 0.5 grams once daily as needed. Refills allowed. Dr. Signature, John Robert, MD. Curtain. And okay. I thought Clarence Steven were old fashioned. Kick the door down, yes. Cereal. Coaxing lesson one. She was pretty bad in the morning, but, she, his but later cereal. felt a bit better, at least good enough to yell on her Minecraft game for a half an hour. That's awesome. Whoa. This Ollie, have you ever played Minecraft together? Cleanliness is next to godliness. Daniel's household duties. Make bed every morning. Clean dishes after every meal. Vacuum hall and room weekly. Take out trash on Monday. Wash hair every two days. Help with Sunday laundry. Count your blessings daily. Wow, fuck this bitch. You turned my, my brother into a slave. I don't appreciate that, and I'm going to have to fight you. Mm, might be enough to open that door. I got a fire extinguisher. All right, that's good to know. Some pills. Holy fuck. This is fuck. a lot of pills. Especially for someone who doesn't believe in science. Can I take these? No. Skizzers. Daniel's haircut makes much more sense now. We? No, I opened it today for the first time after a half a year or so. Ollie, we gotta play Minecraft. We'll have a Minecraft party. Let's do it. I'm down. Search the drawer. Nothing Bras here. and undies. Fantastic. They have grinding Does candies. she even believe in any of this? Closet. It's in the closet. Mm. <sighs> Nothing interesting. Okay, I'm down. Let's go. GG Minecraft server? Maybe. Nice prison, Maybe. dude. I feel like we could get a lot of people to play Minecraft, honestly. I swear. Even her bed looks stern. I used to play a lot of Minecraft, honestly. Yeah. That will definitely explain what's going on with Daniel. Steve Ellison. Miracles. Where did they come from? What do they mean? I heard Minecraft. Yeah, EJ, we're talking Minecraft. Any interest? Okay. Dylan. What the? Yes, Kayla. She's completely obsessed with his power. Sounds like a good idea. Maybe. I'm down for some Minecraft. Oz would probably play too. Let's go. We can get a whole GG Minecraft server. That'd be sweet. Daniel tired after using gift. Nothing gives him energy after. New diet. He acts on his own. Scripture won't impel him. More prayer, more study. Daniel pouted today after lessons. Spare the rod and spoil the child. Not yet. Must show grace. Trust in the Lord. I did cry today watching the miracles. The child must be a vessel. What will he deliver onto us and when? Wow, fuck this bitch. Me too, Isabella, as well. I don't know. Minecraft is a lot of chaos. Not all the time, EJ. Yes. Been out a while, like I We're said, trying to get into today her for the first time. She's locked it up, so it has to be there. Fine. I'll let you know if I see anything unusual. Got it. Oh, shit. Looks like the Reverend Mother got to this letter before Jake. Jacob, thank you so much for telling me about Daniel. I'm on my way to Haven Point now, and please let Daniel know without getting him in trouble, him or you in trouble, that his family has not forgotten him. I don't know where Sh Sean is, and I hope we can find him too. I hope for the best, and if you need anything, please do not hesitate to ask for help. I'm there. Take care, Karen. Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right. Drawer. We got a key. There's some money in there. Let's jack that money. Okay. I found a key. Good. Let's try it. Oh, I'm not done looking at stuff yet. What a great fucking family portrait. That's a creepy-ass fucking drawing. Newspapers. She sure likes to gaze at her own success. Former uprising pa church pastor founds Haven Point. Haven Point church gains in popularity. Well, fuck this bitch. Don't see anything of interest. 
Holy shit, it's a Militic. That's a Pokey. That's a fucking Pokey. We're throwing a clone ball at that bitch. Uh, do, 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 do. I don't know, Minecraft is a lot of chaos and all the time, EJ, but it's been a while. Like I said, I opened it for the first time today after a long time. I'm going to be at Tyler's for the 4th of July, so maybe we can play Fortnite. Awesome. I'm back. I guess it depends on what you play. Minecraft. I love Minecraft. Minecraft. Bed Wars and stuff is chaos. Yeah, April. Uh, Alyssa. Uh, do, 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 do. A lot of Pokemon stuff. Okay. GG Minecraft server. You never know. It could happen. Whoa. They kicked her out of church? Now they're thirsty. From Michael Bloom to Elizabeth Fisher sent. Dear Reverend Fisher, this is Michael Bloom, and I know it's been a long time since we last talked, and I know that our last talk was not a happy one. Despite our differences, we all know that you are a devout spirit to be reckoned with. Nobody has been surprised by your words and your deeds touching so many people. I hope you believe it and when I say we are all proud of you. But we are also sorry and ashamed for asking you to leave the church without understanding the power of your faith. As we need to remind ourselves, mistakes can be life lessons. Even prideful deacons should be humbled before the Lord's wisdom. We hope you find it within your heart to forgive us, and we would be honored to host you for a visit anytime you wish. Bless you, Michael. Militic has been caught by wife, nerd, and armada. Let's go, you three. Did she teach Daniel how to play this? Door. What's in here? Is this Daniel's room? Yeah. Man. It's depressing. Well, Elizabeth doesn't believe in material possessions, so... Doesn't mean you need to decorate your house like a prison. Is she forcing him to do this? Why is he accepting all that? To whom I love, I rebuke and discipline, so be earnest and repent. Revelation 3.19 Picture. He looks happy. Fuck. I can't believe it. Happy birthday, Daniel. Letter. Oh, shit. Holy fuck. People are really all over his power. Uh, Alright. Here we go now. So much for secrecy. Dearest Daniel, I know you may never read this, but I had to reach out to you after witnessing your Holy Spirit last week. I'm a sinner, and I have not been a church-going woman for years, but I heard a story from my neighbor about Elizabeth Fish and your miracles. I could feel the Lord whisper to me, and then I drove all the way back from Truckee to Haven Point when I saw your angel face and knew my faith was coming back. You showed us that God is alive and working through Daniel, you raised the cross like he raised Jesus and found my faith again and am strong, more strong than ever. You were sent to prove that God loves is real and I am saving money to see you again and pray I can be of service forever. Your servant, Lori Conway. P.S. If you want to talk, here is my number, 208-555-0156. Holy fuck, bud. I was going to look in there, but okay. You're just going to take that. That's cool. Finn's bracelet. No matter what happened, I guess Finn was a real friend to Daniel. Ugh, I can't find my scissors. Use a knife. I had a Sprite, and I'm ready for the weekend. Let's go, April. Woo! A knife wouldn't be safe for what I want to use it for. What do you want to use it for? Uh, lean? No, Daniel. Ollie. Oh, man. This sounds super cult-like. It's, so it's, a, a, it's a cult. It's a hundred percent a cult. Like, Book of Daniel, chapter 7, 15. I, Daniel, was troubled in spirit, and the visions that passed through my mind disturbed me. 16. I approached one of those standing there and asked him the meaning of all of this. So he told me and gave me an interpretation of these things. 17. The four great beasts and our four kings that will rise from the earth. 18. But the holy people and the Most High will receive the kingdom and will possess it forever. Yes, and forever. Ever and ever. It's super culty. <laughs> They're so cute. Ooh, Daniel likes Sarah. I'm gonna take that. F 
fuck, I gotta pee again? Goddamn alcohol. What's this in here? is quite the change from Power Bear and friends. Can I open this door? Is there anything in the closet? Can I go in here? No. Okay. Can I go in here? Locked, of course. Try keys. Shaped. Maybe it opens the other door. Cutting some hair. Trim the bushes. Wow. Wow. What's going on over there? Hey. Hey. Knock it off, you guys. Knock it off. By the way, Paula, EJ is cult leader now. Sorry. Oh my god, Ollie, shut up. Try key. Nope. Yes. Oh, it did. That's nice. The oh, perfect. Whoa. Is this her personal archive or something? Yeah. She keeps track of everything in here. Stuff about my sister must be in this one. Okay, I've got something. Must be what you're looking for. Damn. She has pneumonia? And for what I get, Lisbeth knows damn well she needs medical treatment. That's criminal. She's insane. Look, she has a file on you, too. <laughs> you can take a peek and see how she really treats her flock. Man, what's all this? Were you, like, sick? Conversion therapy? Did they... wanted to cure you from... being... Pretty much. I always showed more interest in boys than girls. <laughs> they thought I was a freak. A sinner. Fuck this church. Fuck this cult. Uh, the Mango Lord. My cult is better. Join me, not EJ. What have I missed? We're breaking back into the church and trying to get Daniel back. Paula, I want to go all night catfishing. Armada, can I come with you? That sounds like a fucking blast, honestly. But EJ got mangoes. Oh shit, he's here. Act normal. Haha, ha, Paula has a cult. Oh god, you want cult hours again. Yes, we really are. Uh, chat's hilarious right now. Chat's been hilarious all fucking day today. Uh, I'm lurking. Real cult leaders don't lurk. We trim in bushes and join cults. God damn it, Ollie. I have no bushes to trim. Join my cult. We offer up mangoes to the mango lord. Ollie, no. Sleepy mango and trim bushes. I gotta pee. Yes, you can, Dylan. I'll bring some sandwiches and alcohol. That would be a fucking awesome time. I did late night catfishing once and it was so much fun. I would love to do it again. All right, I am back. Holy fuck, what did I miss here? Uh, we are, what happened is, can no, okay, oh, damn it. The P and Bush cult, that sounds like Dylan's cult. No, Dylan is the donut lord, that's right. Uh, it's hush hush, Ali, ugh, I don't feel good now. What have you done? Heal Kayla, I suppose I shouldn't have ate the pickles. Always eat the pickles. Oh, no, never eat Dylan's pickles. Shut up, Ollie. Free donuts if you join Dylan's donut cult. But jokes aside, feel better, Kayla. And maybe take some rests. Ollie, for fuck's sakes, there are three separate cults in the chats right now. Which should I choose? A, I wrote something nice afterwards. I would rather join the Just New uh, Send Nudes Club. Or cult. Nerd, I would like to join that cult, too. Sun Nudes Colt is the best Colt. Uh, Dylan's pickle makes me less horny. Ollie, do you need me to send you a pickle? Is that, is that what you need right now? Because you're 98% horny. I think you need to calm down. That is not a lie. No way. Ollie makes up the 13%. Ollie is the 13%. Yes. Ollie, I will send you a pickle right now if that's what you are asking for.
God damn it, Ollie. So wife has the send nudes cult. Yes, wife is the leader of the send nudes cult. All right, we're back in here. Um, is that why you ran away? Wait, my yep. beer is empty. I need a new beer. Shit. It took five years to understand what was up. I was too scared, confused. And I you need the really orb beetle. And I was you need sinner, balls. So I thought I had to atone for my sins. Tone. For what sins? I don't get how they can preach this kind of crap. I mean, you met Finn and everyone. Are they sinners then? Of course not. I, I just didn't know different, Sean. Fear back and take trash them. out. You got it. Damn, Jake. He sent me a pickle After snap. A few years. I certainly I did, Ollie. Was in a really bad place. I, I tried to hurt myself. Elizabeth was very upset. We had a long chat. She told me I should leave. Go see the world and figure things out. I, I don't really get her, Sean. But Elizabeth does believe in all of this stuff. I had no clue about your life here. I'm... I'm sorry, Jake. I'm sorry I brought Daniel here. I was just so blown away when I saw what he could do. It was like a real miracle. I, I thought I'd, I'd found my faith again. Instead, I, I just heard him. Then let's make things right. We just have to get Daniel out of here. Oh, it was a full on so. pickle, Paula. And I'll get my sister to a hospital, have her treated. I hope they'll help her. Paula! Paula, you, you gonna make me take a shot? Because you should. Keep our money. For your sister. She needs it. Oh, I, I can't do that, Sean. That, that, that's a lot of... We're okay. It will cover her medical bills. Wow. Thank you, Sean. Sean, are you there? <sighs> What's up? You got company. That thug who works for Elizabeth. He's just holding some files. Doesn't seem to be on to you. This guy is dangerous, Sean. Hey, trust me. I have a good plan to get him out of your way. He'll give you more time. Just give me the word. Do we trust our mom? We tell her no, it might be dangerous. Sure, we'll trust her. Yeah. See what you can do. I will. Get ready. Sean, we gotta hide. Now. Well, shit. I need to take a shot, but I don't have time to take a shot. Um, um, um. Sean, we need to hide. The window's locked. Shit. All right, we can't go out that way. Uh, go in the cupboard. Here, we're screwed. Oh, we can't go in here. Shit. Uh, we'll close the cabinet first off. And uh, hide in the closet. Look, like you just closed yourself in there. Oh, well, now I can take a shot. All right, cool. Thanks, Paula. Hmm. Weird. Better tell Elizabeth about this.
All right, let's see. Holy huh? fuck, bud. What? what the fuck is going on? Sean, do you think... It's gotta be Karen. Oh, he's gone. Let's get out of here. Let's search this closet. Only random stuff. Oh, well, there's nothing good in there anyway, apparently. Searching here. The fuck? W what is it? I think that's the file Nicholas had. Take a look. What? Is she trying to adopt Daniel? Exactly. And she's doing it under the table, of course. Man. All right, let me catch back up. All right, I just ordered some more bars of soap. Armada, who the fuck starts a conversation like that? Uh, why not? Uh, it was a normal pickle with his face. Paula, thank you for the shot. Yes, it was, Holly. Uh, unfortunate. It should have been a special pickle with his face. To wash your mouse out. Mouse. Mouth? Mouth. There's nowhere to hide. Closet, you jerk. The vents. Ha ha. Put the lamp thing on your head and act like a lamp. Yes. We are in a cult. We are the cult. Sneaking. Yes. Ollie, we have been in the cult since Ricky. True. Eyes. Hey, it's the file I had. We have our own trash panda cult, though. No, not the adoption papers. A, burn the papers. I needed more soap, Dylan. Who the fuck needs that many bars of soap, Armada? Did you eat anything else? What'd you order, a hundred bars of soap? Also, I have poutine, and I need to eat that. I can't believe this type of shit still happens today. Oh, I gotta read, though? Oh, fuck, god, shit, damn it. Jacob Samuel Hackerman, date of birth, November 6th, 1996, secretive, refuses to compete in sport, etc., shows little interest in girls, questions the scripture, Jacob feels shame. I feel the Lord wa working through me to save Jacob from himself and the temptations of sin. I have told his parents that he must attend daily prayer sessions with me until he has cast out his confusion. This is a test of faith, and I will not fail him or Jacob. Flyer. Nobody is born gay. Reparative therapy works. Guaranteed testimonials. Trained counselors standing by. Contact us today and let us pray. Be free. A L M. Jacob, note to another boy. Hi, Bruce. Meet me at the parking lot at 11 p.m. Be careful. Can't wait to see you again. J X O. Fuck that. It's okay to be gay. Oh, shit. Why did Daniel tell her so much? I buy three of them at a time. They last me about. A month apiece. Face, body, noodle, one bar for each. Exactly, Ollie. Wait, Ollie, you have a noodle that you need soap for? What's going on over there? Daniel Felipez, Felipe Diaz. Date of birth, April 11th, 2007. What happened to Daniel in Seattle? Does anybody know what else he can do? Search for any living relatives. Daniel, personality traits. Missing mother. Likes to be creative. So spilled things. Trains his gift regularly. Doesn't remember anything. Doesn't remember everything or doesn't want to. Pouts too much. Spoiled. Misses old friends. Noah. Lila. Likes to watch my sermons. Mumbles in his sleep. Loves choco crisps. Today, Daniel told me about layover in Beaver Creek, Oregon. He was hiding out at his grandparents' house and made friends with another boy like him chris or chris of course he wanted to stay uh the police showed up but daniel wasn't clear about what happened next i know he's holding back but the holy spirit will free him from his sins of omission i knew this guy was sketchy but whoa i spoke for armada missing mother as a personality trait yes dang damn holy shit john nicholas bowen date of birth January 27, 1978, incarcerated in Salt Lake City. 
from 1997 to 2008, still has contacts among white gangs, strong faith but never read the Bible, former meth addict, sensitive topic, inclined to pride, newspaper clip, three teenagers rob liquor store, owner shot dead on night of September 20th. A group of young masked men broke into Sally's Liquor Store in Salt Lake City, South Salt Lake. Under the influence of alcohol and drugs, they beat the clerk and stole the cash register. When caught the, by the store owners on their way out, the oldest man pulled a gun and... Letter. Dear Elizabeth, found your address on my jacket this morning. I remembered how much I ended up in this hotel room motel room last night with a meal in my stomach and a warm light in my chest. I can't thank you enough for what you did. Your kind and patient words pulled me out of a downward spiral I've been falling into for weeks. If I remember correctly, you said you were looking for hands to help you build a blank. Uh, oh my god, wife, give me your N64. Fuck. Diaz clipping. She's done Police some serious search research. for suspects Sean and Daniel and Diaz. Seattle shootings ignite protests. Seriously, how can she ignore that? Dear Reverend Fisher, I hope you will forgive what must feel like an intrusion on your church and your beliefs, but I have great respect for what you've done what you've built over the past decade. I have no doubt that the Lord has chosen you for a reason, and I am long I am a longtime personal family friend of the Hackermans, including their precious daughter, who has had too long a time of illness. Blessedly, there is some medical help available that her family has, however, denied due to your advice. They see her ammonia, pneumonia, ammonia, oh my god, pneumonia. pneumonia as a spiritual problem and only you can solve through prayer. While I believe that is partially true, I believe we have to work with the miracles provided by medicine. I hope you can see the severity of the situation, and I feel that it's some personal responsibility for Sarah Lee and her family who are devout people. I'd like to talk next week, if possible, and hear your take on this matter. I hope you are not offended by my outreach. I look forward to speaking with you soon. Sincerely, Reverend Oliver Grand, Calvary Center for Christ, Las Vegas, Nevada. Holy shit, bud. There are so many words. Papers. She's running a tight ship here. The old Gotta Angel Daniel, kind of Reverend that. Elizabeth Fisher, invites you to witness the power of the Lord within our own child and church. Live miracles. Live miracles. Daily noon and 4 p.m. services are all are welcome. Mm, I don't think there's anything worth a look in here. Laptop time. Let's go. Is she actually scared of me? Fellow members, I am sending you this message as a warning that our church may have a disturbed stalker who claims to be Daniel's brother. He is a Mexican teenager with one eye between 16 and 18 who calls himself Sean. Do not engage with him in any way. If you happen to spot him, do not call the police. Alert me or Nicholas at once. He must not be allowed near Daniel or any other members of the church. I pray that you, I have not alarmed you, but we have a responsibility to protect ourselves from any outside threat. Bless you all for your faith, love, and strength, Reverend Fisher. Better get Daniel out of here. Welcome to the Before Reach for the Sky. Our billboards won't bore you. Reach a million drivers a year. Uh, let our expert team of marketing mavens create your next ad. From big to small, we cover the state. Call or email today for a free estimate. Call, email. Reach for the Sky billboards. Henderson, Nevada. All right. Are we done in here? Can I move on with my life? Holy fuck, bud. Did I close? I thought I closed that. What the shit? We already read this. Get out of here. Shit still happens today. We already read the Bibles. We can't break out this way. We can't go out this door. We go out this door. Can you walk faster? I got things to do. Pictures. We don't care about that. Couch. Bibles. Stuff. Is there anything in here I could take? I want stuff. Give me things. Hello? Pills. Skizzers. Window. Stuff. This way, organ, window, religious painting, closet. Is there anything in the closet? Hello? Nothing in the closet. All right, skipping that. Window, look. Nice prison view, dude. All right, fantastic. Nothing out here. Bed, we can't let it do anything with there. Nothing over here. We already looked in all this. Can't go through that way. Uh, can we take Finn's bracelet? 
No matter what happens. No, nope. can't take Finn's bracelet. I guess Finn was a real friend to Daniel. Bible. The book of Daniel. No, nope, we're not gonna take so that. So much either. for a hot dog, man. Oh, well, there's papers in the garbage. What is this? What is this? this? Daniel Fisher? Oh no. Nevada Museum no, that's of Dreams. bullshit. Take a trip back to the past. Friday, April 28th, 2017. One adult, $20. Name Elizabeth Fisher. Nevada Museum of Trains. Take a trip back to the past. Friday, April 28th, 2017. One child, $10. Name Daniel Fisher. Stop trying to steal my brother, you fucking psycho bitch. We're gonna fuck your day up real good. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. We got, we got things to do and places to go. Get out. Alright, I'm going to eat food. So I'm going to say goodbye to the camera. Goodbye, camera. Look. Your mom is hardcore, Sean. Oh, shit. She lit yeah. the church on fire. Hot I damn. Guess she is. Yeah, woman. So we're all good now? I'll go get Sarah Lee. Well, you get Daniel. Then let's meet up at the car, okay? All right. You be careful, okay? You too, Sean. Good luck. Come in, Karen. See anything? No, you're all clear. Awesome. Talk later. Alright, hold up. What am I missing here? Um. Oh my god, wife, give me your N64. I have a GameCube too, but you can keep that. I want the N64. I grew up with this shit. Same, I loved it. Oh my god, GameCube. Yes, I still have an N64. Ah, memories. My grandma has an N64. Dylan, there are, and in those texts, take. Oh! There are commas and periods in those texts. Take a breath in between. This isn't a rap track. You have a cool grandma. Yes. Haha. Ha. Love my ass off. I was vabun with his freestyle, though, Ollie. Vibing. Oh my god, Dylan. What? What? I'm back. Tyler and Sophie are here. Hi. Yay. What did Ollie do while I was gone? Hi to Sophie. Welcome back, Kayla. Hi to Tyler and Sophie. Why me? I didn't do anything. Sophie is wagging her tail. Tyler is on my deck smoking his weed. Oh, little Sophie, I'm glad you and Tyler are chilling. Kayla Hart. Tyler says, hi, Ollie, you are always doing something. Uh, a while and foremost, a degree has appeared thingy. Uh, I disagree. Ha ha, pokey catch. I'm here. Well, I'm getting beaten up by Sophie. Rude. I wish I had some Dr. Pepper. Uh, pokey catch. Gur tail hit me. Holy shit. Her. Okay, I'm leaving now. Bye, Kayla. Why is all this happening in April? I keep looking over every time Dylan reads some like a letter. I love you. Bye. Bye, Kayla. Bye, bye Kayla. Uh, I love you. Bye, bye, Kayla. Bye, Kayla. I love. Let's go, Arson. And Formos has been caught by Armada and wife. Let's go, you two. You rock. Neat. Yay. Woo. Dylan, where is your camp? I am eating food in my face hole, Ollie. Holy shit. That is so much words tonight. Can I go in here? But thanks for checking. Good looking. Whiskey! Hello! What's happening? Oh my god, Dylan. What? 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 What in the butt? <sighs> I said what? What in the butt? Holy fuck, this is a gin. Giant fucking fry. Pause. There is no pausing. Wife, no choking. Hey, whiskey. Some of the wedges are massive. Ollie, sorry. Is it Sylveon Alyssa? It's Sylveon is Alyssa. So this is or Daniel's not-so-secret guard. Great. Good. Let him know what it feels like. Ollie, god damn it! <laughs> I 
I will go bonk myself. Yes. You need a good bonking. Where's the EJ? EJ! Whiskey, how are you today? What's happening? What's going on? How was your weekend? It's Friday. Are you ready to party? Who's that? Is that Karen? Oh, hey. Mission accomplished? Yep. Now the hard part. Did you find what Jacob needed? Huh. And a whole lot more. Thanks for the help. That was pretty sweet. I try. You did well. Hey, I'm here if you need me, Sean. I know, Karen. Thanks. <laughs> EJ, no go bonk Ollie. Ollie is very horny tonight and needs a good bonking. Take care of her. See? See? 92%. Ollie needs to get bonked. Someone bonk so her, you know please. What you can do? No. But let's do it. Oh, Ange, do you want to go bonk Let Ollie? Your power speak through this young vessel. Ollie I needs am a your bonk. Humble sure. servant and will obey what the hell your is this? every command. Speak to me. It's Daniel. Speak. I told you he's. You need special. to go. Someone needs to go take care of Ollie. Hey, Sean, you came back. Enano, little cub, come with me, Daniel. We're leaving. I'm sorry, Sean. I can't. She's full of shit, dude. And she's using you. Daniel has made his choice, Sean. But I'm offering you to join us again. Thanks, Ange. Put your faith in and welcome me, back. And you'll be family. Never. So that's your final decision. May the Lord have mercy on your lost soul. It's time for you to leave our sanctuary. Right now. Not without my brother. I'm not going anywhere. This is my home. She's my family now. Daniel, listen. She's not your family. Sean, who is she? Our mother. Uh. She came here for you. Oh, praise the Lord. Another miracle at our church. Wonderful. Uh, it's all right, Daniel. Go see her. I mean, she's right there. Don't be afraid. I... Uh, I don't know her. Of course. I know. This is hard for you, my son. Stop calling him that. You're just manipulating him, you sicko. <laughs> That's in the eye of the beholder. But since you are his mother, let me ask you. How could you let your child wander alone in the wilderness where were you when daniel was lost where listen daniel i came here as soon as i found out you were here on your own i'm not on my own children are a gift from the lord they are a reward from him you were blessed with a divine gift and you cast him out into the world. Who the hell are you? You might have been his mother once, but when you abandoned him, you also gave up your rights. Isn't your God all about forgiveness? You have no idea what the Bible says. How can you pretend to care about these two children? You left them and your husband to seek out your base desires. Daniel. Honey, she's trying to trick you. Please, think by yourself. You're smarter than this. Daniel, she's responsible for what happened to your father. You don't know anything. It was an accident. That's what this world is about. Accidents, injustice, pain. I'm just so sorry, Daniel. I know. I know how much I hurt you and your brother by leaving. I know that's not enough, but... I hope we can talk about this together. That's what I've been trying to tell your brother, and I'm so glad he listened. You gotta trust us. She's using you 
for her selfish desires. Daniel, this time the choice is yours. Are you going to believe her or me? I... Uh, I... That's right. You can't tempt Daniel from this garden. He'll stay with us, his true family. And we'll never leave him. Go to hell. Come on, Daniel. No! Oh! Holy shit. Reverend, are you okay? Nicholas, they're, they're heretics sent to desecrate our, our church. Okay, what now? Don't you understand? This is over, <sighs> Sean. You have to talk to him. You can convince him, Sean. I won't leave you, Daniel. Not here. Don't be so stubborn, Sean. Your brother chose his path. Your friend, Sara Lee, she's very sick. And Lisbeth won't take her to a doctor. What? She wouldn't do this that. This is pointless. Daniel knows who to trust. A minister from another church even sent her a letter, warning her that she's taking too much risk, that Sarah needs to see doctors. But I don't want Sarah Lee to be hurt. Have faith in me, Daniel. I know what I'm doing. God is speaking to me and to you. She was kicked out of her previous church. Yeah, they knew she was crazy. So she left and founded Haven Point. Why would they do that? Did she do something wrong? Liar! I left on my own because they were all blind. Don't believe his lies, Daniel. I found a letter from Karen, our mother, inside her house. She hid it from you, so you never know she's looking for you. What? You told me she didn't want to see me. See what you have done? Hey, Inano. Back off. No one is going to keep me away from you. I said stop! <sighs> came all this way for you, and nobody will stop me. I'll even cross hell or whatever if I need- Ugh. Sean! He must learn. Listen, I did my best job to be a good brother. And I know I probably failed. I took you for granted. I put you in danger, and I'm sorry. Sean. Don't listen to him. He, he left you just like that harlot did. Shut him up. He can hit me as much as he wants. I won't give up on you. Don't uh, hit him. Uh, Don't let them do that, Daniel. <sighs> if I could go back in time, I would. We'd be in our living room in Seattle. That would get us pizza and snacks, then pick the movie, because we would always fight about it. And she always picked your movie. But I can't do that. All I can do now is fight. Quiet! What are you waiting for? We're the best team in Anu. Stop so it! So we have to keep going no. forward. No! What are you going to kill him? Please! He's my brother! You can burn down our church, but not our faith. Daniel knows you're telling the truth. Don't give up. Nothing, nothing is gonna stop me, Daniel. We're brothers. Daniel, 
Dad always said our blood link was the most important thing. You know. Uh, please! Uh, stop! Uh, Leave him alone! Daniel, listen to him! Stop! No matter what she does, I'll come right back, again, and again! <laughs> I love you, Daniel. I do too. She'd shut him up, now! Don't move, just stop. If you want to kill me, then do it. I'm not afraid. Do it! Shoot! Don't! Go ahead. What? Shoot me in the face. And live with me. No! Stop! <gasps> Daniel! Sean! I'm sorry. Sorry. I was so confused. Thought she was someone else. I'm sorry. Sean, we need to get out of here. Now. Oh no. No. You started this fire. You will all burn in this hell. Move. Let us go. Move it. You won't leave this place. Not with me alive. Open the door, and then Daniel, after all I did for you, you can still repent. I don't believe you anymore! Ugh. Holy fuck, guys.
Well, I'm done eating dinner, <clears throat> and we're back now. My fat ass ate that whole bowl. My fat ass ate that whole bowl too, dear, so you're definitely, don't worry about it. Holy shit, that was good. What just happened was fucking wild. That, was, that definitely was not good. <laughs> Holy shit. Ange wants to bonky bonk? Uh, I mean, winky? <laughs> Holy shit, everybody. That was wild. That whole episode was fucking wild. That was like camping. That was intense. Like I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm. I'll be honest with you. I'm a bit taken back. Dylan, you said it will end like an hour ago or even longer ago. My butt hurts from sitting, but the episode was really wild. Ali, I am so sorry. I, you know, I didn't know that it was gonna be like that. Dylan, you need to play the quarry next. Uh, Jacob's actually been playing the quarry armada. Uh, I think he finished it, actually, the other day. He did finish it? Okay, cool. Uh, Karen's a bad bitch who just wanted to live her best life. So intense. I know, right? This shit's been fucking wild. Let's be real here. Keith's song on the quarry and I never knew. I think it's in the end somewhere. Is it really, Ange? That's awesome. Like a Keith Wallen song in general or a Breaking Benjamin song? Found out in an interview. That's awesome. Like an actual Keith song. Crows. That's really cool. That's, that's honestly really fucking cool. Well, if, uh, if the quarry does happen to go on sale at some point in the future, I will get it. It's a good game. Don't get me wrong. I'm, I'm not saying anything against it. It's definitely a good game. It's very intense. It's pretty cool. Uh, but it seems a little bit short as compared to some of these games. Um... Like, I, I like how Life is Strange does it, where they break it up into each episode. And, like, as you see, like, you know, this episode was four and a half hours. I did a 15-minute intro. I probably spent half, 15 minutes talking. So it was about a four-hour episode, which is really cool. So, uh, okay, I sleep now because it's 2.15 a.m. Ali, I love you. Thank you for making it this long. Uh, thanks for hanging out, and I hope that tomorrow when you wake up, you're not as horny. But, uh, we all know that's not gonna happen, so I hope you get a good bonking and go to bed. Uh, true, Jacob put it in movie mode and left us on our own devices in chat. That's awesome. Uh, I love how awesome chat is for this, uh, this game. It makes it easier to get through the intense scenes and the quiet moments. April, a hundred percent. Like I am a hundred percent with you there, April. That 
the chat with this game just makes it so great. Like, it really does. Like, it, it helps get you through, like, the quiet moments, the intense parts. Like, it, it's really good. Uh, good night, Ollie. Bye bye, Ollie. I love you. Bye bye, Ollie. Ollie, sleep, get some rest. Good night, Ollie. I didn't laugh. Jacob took a two hour nap while we shouted about it, Alyssa. I asked. Love that, Paula. Good night, Ollie. We can't read, Ollie. It's the weekend. Everyone needs a good bonking. Whiskey, you're not wrong. Whiskey, hopefully you get a good bonking this weekend, too. Uh, English is hard for Ollie, especially for Americans. Good night, Ollie. Haha, ha, Ollie. I didn't left yet. Oh my god. <laughs> Well, I'm just going to take this time before everybody departs into their own worlds uh, to say I appreciate all of you hanging out. Uh, Life is Strange Fridays or Fuck Shit Up Fridays are honestly one of my favorite days of the week. Not for Ollie. Oh my God, Dylan. What? What did I do? What are you yelling at me for now? What did I possibly do wrong? Anyway, I'm going to continue. Well, yeah, Slave and Strange Fridays are honestly one of my favorite days of the week. Uh, Tuesdays and Fridays are probably my two favorite streams of the week. I think because they go a little bit longer. But I have a blast doing both of them. They're both great. They're both fantastic. Uh, Friday especially, my Life is Strange streams have just been so fun. Um, I don't normally play like campaign style games or story decision based games like this so it's a really cool twist for me. Uh, English is hard for Ollie, that's not what it said. Wait, what did it say? English is hard Ollie. Oh! Well, yeah, I read, <laughs> Dylan reads whatever he wants. I do, I do. I add words, I take out words. You know, you give me a sentence and I'll make it a whole new sentence. I'm really good at that. Like I can make a storybook just from what you guys talk about in chat and like just read it back to you and it'll be totally different than the way you typed it out to me. But uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Like I said, Friday is definitely my life is strange. Teams have been so fun. Reading skills are a 6.3 out of 10. Yes, they are. He's gonna remix it every time. 100% April. Oh, 6.9. I love that EJ. That's great. But uh, yes, Friday is so much fun. It leads into the weekend, and it just really sets the tone. Uh, I had so much fun tonight. I love these streams. I love hanging out with everybody. I love the chat. You guys are always so active on Fridays, and I absolutely love that. I get a few drinks in me. We have a good time. Uh, and then we also lead into EJ's Kingdom Hearts Saturday stream. Um, I won't spoil anything, but he's got some awesome stuff planned for tomorrow, so you better go check it out. Um... EJ is amazing, and you 100% have to check out his Kingdom Hearts streams. Because, like my Friday streams, EJ's Saturday streams are probably his favorite streams of the week. So, you know, get in there and show him some love, too. It's like that Whisper game you played as a kid. The further it got down in person, the crazier the story was. Dylan does it all the time on his own, though. Paula, that game is called Telephone. Yes. Especially when he wraps down whole books, ignoring every comma or period. Ollie? Shh. <laughs> we forget how to read. Yes, Paula. Chinese Whispers. Yes, that's also the name of it. Uh, who needs reading? I only say that because I can't read. Telephone. Yes. It's called Telephone or Chinese Whispers. I'm pretty sure it, they're the same thing or along the same lines of the same thing. Holy shit, I've talked so much today. I don't normally talk this much, like, on any of my streams. Slouch, yes, yes, sloth. I, I am slouched right now, or in general. Yeah, I don't, uh, I don't think I've talked this much in general in a while. Unless I'm excited, it's called Still 
Stilly style style post. EJ Dylan Dylan EJ. What? Scraggy! You both lost the game. Ollie, go to bed before you get bonked. Scraggy, get the 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 scraggy. Alright, we're taking care of that. Alright, moving on. Um, you've all lost the game. How do you think, how do you think I feel after working all day that streaming, haha, my, dude, my voice dies. I don't talk much throughout the day, EJ, so I can only understand, like, Uh, yeah, yeah. Gay, we're all chatty. April, I love it. Um, okay, wife can bonk me. Ollie, you would like that. Uh, Dylan, what? Hmm, I don't know about this Pokemon. Scraggy's pretty cool. Am I drunk or I think my death run added levels? I have no idea, wife. Uh, cause you never shut up. Yes, Ange. You are 100% right. EJ doesn't shut up. Honestly, I feel like if you get alcohol into both EJ and myself, neither of us will shut up. Most of the time, I'm actually pretty quiet. Uh, Scraggy has been caught by EJ and wife. Let's go, you two. You sound fine, EJ. He's got cute little pants. Yes, he does. Uh, I love that. Uh, I agree, April. You sound fine, EJ. Yes, yes. Dylan, EJ, what? You talk a lot. Yes, I know. I, I do talk a lot, but only if alcohol is involved. Most of the time, I'm actually pretty quiet. I'm kind of just chilling here. I think I also had like three or four shots tonight and a handful of beers. The death run doesn't end now. Oh, fantastic. I also feel like these egg, like outros, is that what they're called? Whatever, the credits. Uh, they last way too long. Uh, Dylan, I'm glad you have fun talking with all of us. April, I love talking with all of you guys. Honestly, it's one of my favorite things about streaming. It's just like being able to chat with you guys. Because most of the time, I'm honestly just sitting at my computer playing video games in silence. Or I'm talking to wife. And other than that, it's very quiet. So I love talking with you guys. Dylan, what, Ollie? Ollie, what could you possibly do to me now I love you Ollie have you tried not being quiet I like being quiet though I get progressively louder as the alcohol you know it, it hits uh, chat get ready haha <laughs> Ollie god damn it Ollie Uh. <laughs> I fucking love that. You guys are all amazing. We all get progressively louder as the alcohol hits. I mean, you're not wrong. You're definitely not wrong, Paula. Alcohol really, I mean, like, it, it just amplifies you in general. Paula, you get... That is not true, EJ. Paula does not get quiet. Yes, we understood the assignment. Yes, you all understood the assignment. I I, I love that emote. Wife, you did fantastic. Wife literally made that tonight. Like, during this stream. Like, this, this happened tonight. During this stream, she made that whole emote and got it uh, <coughs> uploaded... And ready for you guys. Also, that burp was for all of you.
I become self-aware after a while. Oh, that's when I get quiet. Paula, that's not true. Paula, heart, wife is a badass. You're amazing, Alyssa. Ha, thank you, Dylan. Why jank? Why, why jank you, Dylan? Why jank you too, EJ? Uh, for any amazing streams. I love you all. We love you, wife. EJ, I love you. Uh, everybody, I appreciate you all so fucking much for coming out and hanging out with me all the time. Like, it means the world to me. Like, honestly, if we didn't have the community that we did, I would not keep streaming, honestly. Like, I don't do it for money. I don't do it for recognition. I don't do it for any of that. I do it for you guys because I enjoy hanging out with you. I, I know for a fact that some of you just need this. Like, I don't... I. I I don't find myself entertaining, but some of you find me entertaining and you know, I just enjoy the vibe of hanging out with everybody and like we all have good banter and we all have fun together and we have a great community and we all care about each other. Like it's great. And I'm so glad that like, you know, you guys feel safe here and that you come back and hang out with not just me, but for EJ as well. Like we have a good time and I love that. Like. I am just here for the Pokemon. Steph, I understand. You also don't know where the unsub button is, so I get that, Steph. But I appreciate you being here just for the Pokemon, Steph. Uh, I find your mom entertaining. Yes. God, I love the roast. Oh, EJ! So, so they came up with a good idea, and I feel like we need to get roasted at some point. Uh, we need to do, like... A, a, like a, a group stream where we get me, you, and Jacob all to throw on our cameras. One of us will stream it, and chat will just roast all of us. And then at the end of it, we can roast chat. Well, whoever wants to be roasted, because we don't want to roast people who don't want to be roasted. But I feel like everybody would have a great time with that. Love you, staff. Hey, you roast us all the time. Are these credits still going? I'm 36 now. Fucking right, April. Like, these credits are so goddamn long. I vote Jacob Streams. I'm here for that, EJ. Uh, Paula, thank you for the Hot Ones point. It's been 84 years. It has been. Uh, it's not like we don't roast you all the time anyway. Shh. I want roast. I'll eat popcorn. I'm very easy to roast. What up, Mike? All right. Now, let's finish this out. Um, let's go over our, our results here. You passed both vision tests, 31%. You passed one of the vision tests, or you failed both vision tests. We passed both because we're fucking awesome. So 31% for us. Let's go. Uh, you told Agent Flores that the robbery was Finn's idea. You told Agent Flores that the robbery was your idea. Or you told Agent Flores that the robbery was everyone's choice. Well, we're being honest, and yeah, it was definitely Finn's idea, and he tried to kidnap our brother, so fuck that guy. Uh, you escaped the hospital without hurting anybody. You convinced Joey to help you escape. You attacked Joey to escape the hospital. You attacked the guard to escape the hospital. Hot damn, there were some fucking wild results you could have gotten there. Uh, well, we escaped without hurting anybody. Uh, Finn wasn't at the hospital. You didn't talk to Finn, or you talked to Finn and blamed him for what happened in Humble, or you talked to Finn and forgave him for what happened. Well, we just didn't talk to him. We had to get to Daniel. So, fuck Finn. Uh, you broke Daniel's toy while taking it back from Chad. Fuck you, Chad. You're definitely a Chad. Uh, you didn't try and take the toy back and didn't break it. Well, we tried to take it back. So, fuck you, Chad. Uh, you sang the song in Spanish, you refused to sing, and got beat up. You were not asked to sing a song. Well, we refused to sing, and we got our ass kicked. Uh, you got into Anton's truck to reach Haven's Point, or you didn't get into the truck and walk to Haven's Point. Well, fuck walking, right? That guy gave us a sandwich and a nap. So, hell yeah. Uh, you gave money to the church, or you didn't give money to the church? Fuck that church. I am glad we didn't give money to that church. Uh, you cut this conversation with Karen short. You were hard on Karen during the conversation, or overall you let Karen try and open up to you. We let her open up to us. 
Uh, you smoked a cigarette with Karen. You stayed outside with Karen when she smoked, or you didn't stay outside with Karen. Well, we smoked a cigarette because we're degenerates. Uh, you accepted Karen's help to clean up your wound. You refused Karen's help, or Karen didn't even offer to help. Well, we accepted Karen's help to clean up our wound because fuck doing it ourselves, right? And, you know, we're trying to be nice to her. Uh, you got Nicholas suspicious when sneaking into Haven, or Nicholas was unaware of your presence. Well, we're sneaky, so Nicholas was not aware of our presence. Uh, you shared your money with Jacob, or you didn't give any money to Jacob. Well, we wanted his sister to get better, so we gave money to Jacob. Uh, you got caught by Nicholas, or you managed to hide from Nicholas. 69. Nice. We managed to hide from Nicholas. And uh, you shot Elizabeth while Daniel wasn't hurting her. Uh, you let Daniel unleash his power on Elizabeth while he was hurting her. Uh, you and Daniel both spared Elizabeth's life, or you shot Elizabeth while Daniel was hurting her. Um, we just let that bitch be on her way. We probably should have killed her, but, you know, it is what it is. Oh, was that it? There wasn't a second page or anything? Whoa, 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 sheesh! Dylan is a chat. This is it. Fuck off, Steph. We made it, Daniel. Wait, where are we? What What's are we going doing on? Now? Make our way across. You ready? Yeah. I think. Oh shit! Oh shit, shit! I'm not ready! The last one! Yes! So, that was episode 4 of Life is Strange 2. And, um, you know, if you missed it earlier, as with tradition, I have plans next Friday. So there is going to be no Life is Strange stream on Friday. And for the season finale, we're going to have to wait two fucking weeks. April, I don't think you're ready. I really, I, I don't think you're ready for this. Plus, you have to wait two whole weeks for it. Because I won't be here next Friday. Uh, next Friday, my mom and my little brother are coming to visit me from the States. Which is awesome, because I haven't seen them in years. Like, three years. So, I'm really looking forward to it. Um, actually... Because I won't be doing my Life is Strange stream on Friday, and because my mom and my little brother are visiting me, I know one of the days that they're here, uh, my mom plans on taking Alyssa out to have a spa day. Uh, you know, a little girl's day out type of deal. Well, I might try and do a little pop-up stream with my, with my little brother. Um... I don't know what we'll be doing. We might just hang out, chat for a little bit. We might hang out on the patio, do some grilling. RJ, what's happening? But this is the first time I've seen my little brother in like three years. He is 15 or 16 years old now. Uh, but he's an awesome little kid. He's one of the nicest people you'll ever meet. Um, he is so much better of a human being than I am on so many levels. So he is just like the most harmless, innocent little baby child. Like, you know EJ's innocence? Well, take that and multiply it by like 200. That's my little brother's innocence. So, maybe ask how old he is. He is, yeah, that's probably a good idea, Ollie. Mini Dylan, uh... Not quite. He is, he is just... We'll have to wait and see. EJ is not innocent, come on. I know, I know, Ange. You know, it's just, I, I feel like at this point, it's just kind of a running joke. EJ is not innocent. Uh, but he's adorable, and I miss him a lot. And my mom is going to steal Alyssa for a few hours. And because I'm not doing my Life is Strange stream, be on the lookout. I will make an announcement if it happens in Discord. Uh, but there might be a, uh, a little pop-up stream. It'll probably be about an hour, maybe less, uh, but it'll just be me and my brother. And if he could come out and say hi, I'm sure he would love that. Uh, 
he is in our discord he is the only baby child in our discord uh he doesn't ever talk in there too much um but yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. so maybe it'll it'll be a good way to like integrate him a little bit you know get him to know everybody greet him so it would be nice to see some of you come out and say hi to him he's a really nice kid and I'm sure it would make him happy. Uh, his name is Connor, by the way, C-O-N-N-O-R, for anybody who wants to say his name when he gets in, if we have a little pop-up stream. I don't even know if this is gonna happen yet. This is just all possibilities. So I'm just letting everybody know ahead of time. Uh, again, I will make an announcement in Discord about it if, uh... So we've seen, uh, I, I don't know how much of our chaos he's seen. Uh, I don't know how often he uses Discord. He kind of, he, you know, he's got his own life, so I don't really know. So, but yeah, again, this was episode four, uh, Life is Strange 2. And in two weeks, we will have the finale of Life is Strange 2. And I, I'm going to warn everybody right fucking now that... Life is Strange 2, regardless of what ending you choose, it's fucked up. Like, I hope everybody is emotionally prepared in two weeks, on Friday, for the ending of this sh this game. Because it's going to be an emotional fucking roller coaster. Um... That's all I got for you. Um, I will remind everybody, tomorrow is Saturday. Uh, EJ does his uh, Kingdom Hearts stream. And I know he's got some new stuff. So please stop by and support him, as I know you all will. Dylan, none of us is emotionally prepared. Let's be real. We haven't been since 2008. Ollie, I love you for that reference. We are never emotionally prepared. We just hold on for dear life. Ha ha, good luck. Yes. But, um... Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is what I got for you guys. I... I know some of you work this weekend. I know some of you are off this weekend. But... We're all emotional wrecks 24-7. Come on, boo. I know. I know, EJ. I know. But I'm just telling you, this last episode, it hits hard. Like, it hits... It really hits hard. Especially if you've been following this series so far and seen the choices that we've made up to this point and all the things that have happened up to this point, the last episode, it hits really hard. I might get drunk and I might cry for all of you on stream. So if you want to see me cry, it might happen. I don't, I don't really know. But, uh... That's all I got for you guys. Please have a good weekend. Stay safe. Have fun. I love you all. I, I really appreciate all of you hanging out. I, I love my Friday streams. Just as much as EJ loves the Saturday streams. And I hope to see you all there. There's only been one episode that's made me cry so far, and that was in the first Life is Strange. Uh, and sadly, yes, I, there is a clip of me crying on YouTube. <laughs> We're not going to get into that, though. Um, yeah, Chloe in the wheelchair. That that made me cry. I, I, I couldn't... I lost it at that point. I had... I needed a moment. I needed a moment. It was an alternate time. It was an alternate timeline, but it still made me cry. You know, you emotionally invest in these characters and the storyline and the decisions that you make and the choices that you do. And it really hits you hard, especially if you're drinking. Oh my God, he has emotion. Shut up, Steph. I don't show him, but I have him. As always, I love you all. I hope you have a great weekend. Stay safe. Have a good time. Don't drink too much. EJ smells. He's sus. And he's also streaming Kingdom Hearts tomorrow. So go fucking check that beautiful man out. I love you all. Have a great Friday. Have a great weekend.
And uh, yeah, I love you. Bye-bye.